What's up everybody? This is in the city of Norwalk. There's a truck over here that was involved in a crash. I'm gonna assume it's this gentleman right here in the white hat. Looks like Santa Fe Springs. Fire department is here. This is here by the Food for Less. What's up? She was got fault. Oh. She started it. Crazy. The elderly guy with the big foot, cowboy hat? Yeah. He told me that she was driving so fast when he when she hit him. Oh wow. Yeah. Crazy. Did anybody get taken to the hospital? The lady said she paralyzed from oh. everything she could do. Whoa. So somebody here just told me that this driver got transported possibly seriously injured. And uh, the bystanders here are saying that it was her fault. All speculation right now, but that's what I'm hearing. This is a Hyundai Elantra. It looks like they probably jaws of life her out of there after that. Major crash, and apparently she hit this truck over here. He said she's paralyzed, but uh, I'm not sure. He said she couldn't move from the neck down. This is LA County, truck 25 that's leaving right now. Some other gentleman over here giving a statement. I didn't know this was open to traffic. <laughs> There's just traffic cruising through here now. If you're just joining us, this is in Norwalk on Washington by the Food for Less. I think this is Santa Fe Springs right here. Fire department that's leaving. Truck 82. Happy Saturday night, everybody. This came out on my way to LA, so I, start, I thought I'd stop by and check it out. This is in Norwalk. Apparently the woman in this black Hyundai was transported with serious injuries. Massive commercial fire in Lomita. Thank you for that. Marky Mark, thank you. I'll check it out here in a minute.
It's in the food for less parking lot here. So this side, no damage. It looks like Jaws of Life pulled this door off or open. We're about to leave. This is crazy crash. Prayers to that woman. I hope she's not paralyzed. What's up, everybody? Happy Saturday night. So I was on my way into LA and this came out. I was listening to it for a little bit, it sounded serious. The person that I was talking to that was standing on the sidewalk said that from the accounts of the driver and the truck that the lady was at fault. But uh, <laughs> I, don't, I haven't been to too many scenes where people jump out of the car and they go, hey, I, it was me, I was at fault. That doesn't happen very often, so you never know. You never know what's happening, but uh, I hope that lady's not paralyzed. That looked like a very crazy crash. Welcome everybody, it's Saturday night. Uh, we have about 60 ponchos. I grabbed them uh, on my way out. We have a bunch of ponchos to hand out. Uh, Old Fart Andy from the chat sent in some tuna kits. We also got some socks. We got some feminine hygiene products from Stargator. We have a couple things to hand out if we see anybody that needs them. And I'm on my way right now into LA to have a cruise. Welcome everybody that's just showing up right now. If you're watching this on replay, please let me know in the comments that you're part of my replay crew. Let me know where you're watching from. What up, Sonia? What up, L-E-E, Sean35, Marcy? I'm still kind of getting set up here, so bear with me for another few minutes. But uh, welcome, it's great to see you. There was a guy there wearing a, a Bronco jersey. Looked like Champ Bailey. It looked like a Champ Bailey jersey, not the, the dude wearing it. it. Didn't look like Champ Bailey. Uh, let me see here. I'm looking at a possible fire that's within striking distance for us to. That sucks. It looks like it's a worker's truck too. So it's always a little bit worse. You know, it's gonna put them out of work. Lomita. I'm sorry I missed anything if I was out there. Thank you to LEE for helping me out tonight on the mod. Appreciate that. Let's see what else is going on. I missed a couple cash apps and oh the the helicopter is going over right now. Uh, you can kind of see it through the trees there. Uh, I missed a couple cash apps last night. Thank you so much to everybody that threw money in my cash app for the gas tonight. We have a full tank of gas because of that. Thank you to Michael Galea who sent me a cash app right before the stream. Shout out to Michael. I'm checking out the structure fire right now.
I usually stop and kind of like get everything ready before I before I fire it up, but tonight I just fired it up. Oh, they're moving the truck over here. Oh, it's still drivable. Oh, the cops driving it. Okay. All right. So uh, maybe he's not gonna miss a day of work. I don't know. Looks like he might be able to attend. Might be two zero four thirty one. Might be two zero four three. Who's up for? I'm gonna see my status now. Avenue. And 12Z5, Roger. And a half East 55th Street. I'm a unit on a Coast 6. Identify and repeat the location. We're going to be on 2 1 of Montaya. 11837, Roger. With a delay, identify. I'm looking right now to see you know, if it's going to be worth it for us to go to Project, Lamita. Lamita's pretty far. Not that we couldn't do it, but I'm not sure if we should yet. I'm going to look at this truck. Very hard crash. I right now it's telling me a half hour to get there. And we could get there, it would be a, like, I'm not saying that we're not gonna go, but I'm just kind of running through in my head what I think will happen. We get there. They have it blocked off so far out because they don't want anybody to get close, especially if it's a big fire. And then at that point, I've already invested a long drive, so I'm just standing there kind of showing the fire personnel that's just chilling. So I don't know. It's not that I don't want to see it, I just don't know if it'll be worth it by the time we get there. And where it leaves us, you know. Now it's Saturday night and we're not in LA. So all kinds of stuff's popping off in LA, but we're 40 minutes out. Traffic in it here. Traffic collision 374 in Trotta is now an ambulance traffic. 374 in Trotta is code 3 now. City of Norwalk. Keep it rocky. 5151, Cassandra, 3409, COVID 839, we'll hand on unit 4 next, 20, code 3 from Gage and Figueroa to 66, 65 FR. 8835, 8835, switch to simplex for AW53. Apartment 3S, as in Sam, to the PR, we'll do it to a neighbor, Mel White. Right here. 
All right, so I am going to take us over to the fire. I'm not sure if it's the right choice or not, but I'm going to do it. I just came from that area. That's why I was reluctant to pull the trigger. I literally just did this drive. Code 6 North South Valley, South of 470 to Normandy. Not right toward 815. And then just as quickly as I talked myself into it, I think I'm talking myself out of it. I've just been doing this a while and I know right after I park what I'm actually going to be looking at. It's going to be cops telling me, sorry, you can't go in three blocks away because it's something major and now I'm just stuck standing there. Chen Wei, thank you so much. Thank you for the sticker. And I just talked myself back into it again. Three four two eight or two twelve fifty nine. Thirty one up eight two zero six. Thirty one up eight two zero six. Come in. Thirty one twenty code three from. George Freeman Roger. How unit toy? Thirty one twenty code three from. The reason that I'm back into going is because we just don't go to that area very often, so I'm trying to add a lot more variety into our streams. One is described as a no black with black braid, 6'2", 180 to 200 pounds, wearing a dark jacket with black pants, and possibly a black surgical mask, such as one with a arm with a Rose, thank you very much. Metal caliber. Suspect 2 is going to be described as a no black, black braid, <coughs> black pen, 180 to 200 pounds. Faded dark jacket. Dark pants. Black muscle surgical mask armed with a gray block. Handgun unknown. Suspect 3 is described with a male black with an asshole type hair. 58510. Dark pants. Dark jacket. Black muscle uh, surgical mask. Property taken is going to be a gold and dime. Be in their direction to help shut, shut down traffic. Requesting unit eastbound 66 and figure out. The Grateful Dead shoes and a black metal watch. All right, here's the point where I either continue straight and go to the fire or I take a left and go into LA. I still don't know what I'm going to do. I think it might be a good fire because I've just talked myself out of it and then back into it like three times. Usually when that happens, it's worth it. <laughs> 2015, I'm very indecisive. I also never have a plan when I'm doing this. The plan is always no plan. Every time. I'm letting the vibe take the wheel. I don't know how further the dust at the transport is. Uh, I am going to the fire, though. Buckle up. P, not needed. Roger, Roger. Roger, Roger. Roger, Roger. Roger, Roger. 
need to bring Linda with me just so that she can sleep in the passenger seat so I can use carpool lane. Four fifteen. Code six, twenty two twenty eight, Central Street, four eight three Laurel Canyon, Big Red's target. The dark area is a target. Monocom is code two at three four four zero or D fifteen twenty four North Hollywood you've been equipped to call it front. I think I'm going to try to make this a long night, so I have a full tank of gas. I'm expecting to bleed that whole tank. We did almost the whole tank last night. Ooh, thank you to whoever just hit up my PayPal. Please, somebody remind me at the end of the night to check all the donations. I missed a couple cash app. A couple PayPal. I'll read them tonight at the end. I really apologize to them for that. It just blew, slipped my mind. Ivan, what up, bro? Hi, yes, we have a response for you from 158 Southwestern to 115. Hello, I'm Vicky Nance, 211 Island, 1611 Southwestern Avenue, 1611 Southwestern Avenue, at the Falls Junior, Point of Sale Panic Alarm, Code 3, Incident 3445, and RD 2081, from the beginning time to identify. This is the Easter stream, so we have to make it special. Hi from Signal Mountain, Tennessee, what up? Jan loves Iowa, thank you for the Venmo. Thank you, Jan. Roger, verify your code 6 at Adams and Big at the mobile gas station. Frequency 445 Gantz Island at 115 on Kenmore. I just tried to get into my PayPal and it said face recognition not recognized i wonder if i look too tired i need to save a picture of myself in my phone looking super tired so it doesn't block me i don't feel tired but i look tired Chenway again, thank you Chenway. Chenway Jameson, thank you so much. I'm guessing it's going to be similar to last night when I'm going to need you guys to kind of take care of yourselves in the chat. And thank you for recognizing that I'm not going to be in the chat a whole lot. When the roads are wet like this, it's pretty sketchy. 
Security Health Main, Code 10, 5418, 31. The security guard that pepper sprayed the subject is at Chick fil A on 7th and Figueroa, and the subject who was pepper sprayed left the location on the Metro. Um, Okay. Okay. Southeast Watch 4, Code Alpha, check out with the Watch Commander. Southeast Watch 4, Code Alpha, check out with the Watch Commander. Port Street at the residence. Code 2 and 3, 4, 6, 8, RD 1265. Welcome everyone. Happy Saturday night. Thank you to everybody that's returning that hung out with us last night. We had a fun night last night. What up everybody, welcome. I'm taking us to this Lomita fire. It looks like a pretty big apartment fire. We're already invested, so we're gonna go see what it looks like. Uh, this is 91 West that we're on right now. We'll be there in about 15 minutes-ish. Bob Bruno, thank you so much. Thank you, Bob. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday to all the lurkers. Boston and Homestead, we're facing northbound, and can I get an additional unit? 1328, requesting an additional unit, Boston and Homestead, facing northbound. 2845, close to all, close to all, check your truck. Jurisdiction in the route. 28, George 36. Do something. Let's take Wilmington and off. I understand that. Five countries are voicing additional unit. Wilmington and off. Units respond identified. Five eight five. Five eight point three. Five eight two five. I have a feeling it's gonna be a long night, so we have a lot in store. Insert name here. Don't forget to click the like. Thank you so much. Insert name here. Happy Saturday. Jan loves Iowa gifted five. Thank you, Jan. Thank you for the Venmo too. Shout out to all my Iowans in the chat. Who's fo who's following Iowa girls basketball? Anybody? Anybody in the chat have a Clark jersey? Probably two five point three is at northeast corner of Great BMW by nine Frank David correction nine George Frank David three five five. Twenty eight six nine seventy six nine eight go six. Contact unit, meet 1239 at 65 and Clark for an ambulance traffic. See pain involved with down power lines. Incident 3409. Public so Highway 110 South, subject to Mount Senate, Airport Road. Jan loves Iowa, member for six months. Thank you so much, Jan. Clark, 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 Shout out to Jan. Shout out to all the Iowans that might be in the chat tonight. <laughs> Southwest unit yeah, possible. Dave Atkins, thanks for the Rental ride. Suspect, Thank you, Dave. Ninety-five Crenshaw Boulevard in the warehouse. Shoot zero suspects are two female blacks. Number one is wearing a red and blue, progression red and burgundy top with black pants. Number two is blonde hair, wearing a pink top, pink pants. Suspects have a vehicle waiting outside. Parked on Rodale, Sin, shout out to Jeremy and, and the lurkers watching. Yeah. Thank you to Brian L for the cash app. Carl, 
Car Free KC, member for nine nine months. Shout out to Car Free. Car Free's been in here a long time. Appreciate that. Thank you guys for the support. All right, we're getting closer. We're about 11 minutes out. And then after this, we can chase a couple Orange County calls on our way into LA. And a 415 man, second number one at Starbucks. Code 2 incident 3425 at 2017. Code 2 incident 348 RD 638. Control unit 2 now, suspect just left 735 South Figueroa from the Nordstrom. Suspect was seen running from the location towards 7th Street of Male Black, 30 years, 510, short beard, wearing a blue and white Nike tank top, blue jeans, and a blue and white snapback. Let's go to the 3485, ready 161. That's the real, the smoke shop. 6849, Roger. Are you close enough to them? 40 Patty J, member for three months. Attention, coming in. Information on the traffic in the area. 7th and Hoover. Sounds like we're last seen at Westbound 7th Street in a gray Toyota Rav4 or Honda Cross over on the plate of Mount Sonic wearing a green shirt. Information incident 3493. Sonia, Sonia, Minnesota, sixty-nine. Thank you very much. Thank you for Where's gifted memberships. Roger. Happy Saturday, Sonia. Suspects there now is now a 211 suspect just left at 3695 Crenshaw Boulevard. Suspects pushed the employee out of the way to exit the store. Suspects are two female blacks. Number one is wearing a red and burgundy top, black pants. Number two is blonde hair with a pink top, pink bottoms. Vehicle, suspect vehicle is a white Cadillac SUV. That's seen southbound Crenshaw. It's close three incident 3479 RD 353. Okay, Victor 1, 8 Victor 1, are you clear? I need to have a supervisor, meet 7285-4175-394. Fry my nipples, thank, thank you, you for the sticker. 17849, question. 17854-17L150. So you've been to 16A11, 16A11, you're on no trouble at 1330. If you just got a new membership, please thank Jan or Sonia for that. Suspect there now for their location 13825 Paxton Street in front of that location. Suspect is a male Hispanic black sweater armed with a knife. Snow code 3 incident 3481 RD 1622. This area that I'm going into, this is covered by one of my friends. His name is Brent. He's got a channel called Alert SoCal on X and uh on YouTube. Please go check him out. Uh, Ellie, definitely. I see that. Hold on. Roger. All right, we're getting closer. I'm, like, you're the PR I'm looking for smoke, but it's so cloudy that it's hard to see. Roger. It's something, uh, you don't need any resource, but just apply the, uh, circle unit for eight months. It's something you can find a freeway yeah. on payroll and PCH. Right there, the, uh, on top of that. Roger, will you be standing by there, sir? Uh, right. uh, people put green hearts in the chat when they're trying to let me know that some membership stuff just went on. And I really appreciate that. Sometimes I'll look over and I just see green hearts in the chat. I know that I need to look and see if any membership stuff happened. I miss a lot of it. So people are just trying to let me know. <laughs> Start a fire. Thank you, Jan. 
I do have a fire. I have a fire extinguisher in here that Kim K sent. That's in the hatch tonight. Hopefully, we won't need it. Two one six zero seven. Two two one six zero seven. So switch to the boyfriend. Let's go three and three five zero seven eight two six one. Ball black clothing. Seven fifty miles. Hispanic black top. Blue jeans. Code three and three five zero two R D fifty one. Seven three three three. He declared myself seven two fifty two Victor one over three ten. Watch three. Show clear, please. Seven three Victor one three ten. Clear. Ten three three two five R D four fifty one. Four ninety seven. Can you hear us, Dippo? Four ninety seven. Say bye. Bye, gentlemen. Harbor unit 1058 5, 58, 5, 8, 5, 8, 5, 8, 4, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, I just took, I I tried to adjust Ellie so that she could do the um the chat and I think I took it off on accident. Sorry about that. I'll fix it here in a second. Sixty three degrees seven five one and two. I'm making the changes on my phone and I have big fingers and so sometimes I like butter fingers some option that I don't want. Tonight, if you put it down. Roger, and that he's not going to be up to you. See ya. Address of the residence where the power line As usual, I didn't think we would be over here tonight. Welcome to Figueroa Place in Anaheim. Roger. I see an airship above us. Yes, sir. Shout out to Veronica. What up, Veronica? What up, JLC? What up, Patty? Enemy you Moon, have, Joy uh, Joy. Thank you to Vanessa for helping me out. Thank you for, to Ellie Boy, for helping me out. What up, Waves? What up, Lemon King? Man, it's only one minute now on the EDW domestic violence for the comments. Still good, Avenue per L90. 35, Roger, send it. Bye, break. What's up? What's up? 35, Roger. Six four zero five Mulholland. One six four zero five Mulholland. Drive. Okay, so here's my. We drive close. That the cops are gonna make us stop so far out, and they're gonna say like, "What are you doing over here?" They're gonna ask media or whatever, and then either way, I think they're gonna be like, "Nope, you can stay way back here where you're not." I think that's what's gonna happen, but I don't know. It sounds like a fire truck. Definitely a fire truck. South traffic units, ambulance traffic, pedestrian involved, Anaheim and Neptune, Anaheim and Neptune, victim is a male, 50 years, blue hat, jean jacket, jeans, still at scene. 
Those are incident 3509, RD522. So it's looking like reception is bad over here. 25, Coach Control, trying to get it back for your location. Airship right overhead. Or maybe uh, maybe that's news, uh, I don't know. It could be media, it could be Orange County. Right, sure. Verify common name, information only. Suspect goes to your office. Roger. You can show call for David search on so yeah, when I get up here, if reception's bad, I'm still going to see if I can find a place that it will even out and make it worth it for me to stay. I'm prioritizing the stream. That's what I do out here on the weekends. It's about the chat. It's about the stream. If it turns out that the reception's not good, I just need to leave and then take us somewhere where the reception's better. So just know that I'm going to be monitoring it. And if it does, doesn't look good, then I'll leave. We'll be there in one minute. Okay, it's an 1841, 1841. I'm gonna stop it. Gonna drive up, and I have a next one called 373 Anaheim and 3509, 35 Tony Tom. Suspect of the Malice family, and 20 black Twitter, black jeans with a knife, entered the property from the alley and entered it. I'll need my torch. Okay, so this is what I was talking about. They're blocking everybody out right here, like this far back. And this is like some or what they do in Orange County. If there's a big incident, they just start pushing it so far back. And then you have to be one of the first responders to get in there. So I think I might have to park all the way out here and then walk in, which is fine, but. Roger. They're underneath the vehicle. As soon as you make the right turn on the 82. Uh, it's going to be about 10 yards to your right, it's going to be a red car right in front. Give me just a second. I have a lot of gear with me right now. So this is what I was saying. Blocked off this intersection. In Orange County, they can really like block it out and keep everybody that needs to be in there in there. In LA, I think it's a little bit more difficult because it shuts off a lot of routes when you do that. Oh shit, I'm seeing it now. I'm seeing a lot of billowing smoke. Uh, my homie that covers this area, his name's Brent, and his channel's Alert SoCal. Please go throw him a sub. 
YouTube and on Twitter. Sorry about the shakiness. When I get there, I'm gonna throw it on a tripod. I'm seeing what looks like residents over here. I see a big white dog. Feel bad for these residents. They're just watching their homes burn up. Trying to see where the best spot's gonna be. I definitely see flames over here. It's a hose going down on it right there. Hold on, I'm gonna try to find us a better spot. It's pretty crowded as far as where I can go. Give me a second. I think that might be the only good spot. adjust this here.
So here's the scene. I don't think we're going to get a better spot. shaking I'm trying to get my tripod out while I try to hold this on the action so I'm trying to move to my big camera setting up the camera right now. Give me a second. out here in a second.
the two news crews are right up here at the at the spot that we were just at. Uh, so that is the best spot. This spot's a little bit more orange. So you can see a little bit more of the flame, but there's not a good spot to see it. Both of the two news cameramen are still in that same spot that I was just at. I'm gonna try to see if I can extend uh, over this area over here. I don't think so. I'm gonna try to go down this road that's in front of where I was before. There's no, nobody can go past that? No, where they are at, that's where we're allowing people. Oh, gotcha. Okay? Thank you. So he's got shut down. Try to go around where that was. The guy that kicked me out's watching me, so I gotta go a little bit further back. Uh, I know he's still watching me. He's gonna shut me down again. Trying to get a wide shot. We already saw what it looks like close up. Here's the command post right here. Or maybe like rehab, where they come over and get their water and their snacks and stuff. We have, uh, we've got residents that fled over here. I can see a dog and some residents. Okay, so the building is in a valley. So we're not gonna be able to have another view other than the one that we already had. You can see it coming through the trees right here. But there is no better view. This side's only smoke. A lot of smoke though. All right, I've gotta go back where we were. Now it's raining. This is the jack-in-the-box across the street. I think this thing's gonna burn for a while. It's got a lot of fuel. Shoot. 
So the original shot we had is still the best shot. Right through that little crease.
think they might have a place set up for the residents to kind of hang out back in there. That's a guess, I don't know. I think they probably have support for the people that live in that apartment. These are apartments. And there, there's not a better angle. I know this is not a great angle. There's not a better one, unfortunately. Personnel. 
A lot of resources from LA and Orange County. All down the street. Uh, this is like a charger, like a, a fire department charger right here. Los Angeles.
there's really just not much more of a shot. We can either get one, sh we can either get that shot that we just had. Uh, the building is in a valley. So when I go across the street, all you can see is smoke. You can't see any firefighters at all. So unfortunately, that shot that we just had, that's the only shot. That's why all the news stations were standing right at the exact same spot. So I think we are gonna take off. There's really not much more we can see from here. Apologize about the angle. There just was not a better angle. Everything that we saw was all that we were going to be able to see. We got a fire captain doing an interview right here. I'll see if he'll give us an interview after this. I don't know if he will or not. Kind of 50 50. The support area is right there to the left where they're getting their Gatorade and sheltering from the rain. The fire is right back here, right toward that blue and purple. But like I was saying, there's no way to get a good angle on it because the apartment is down in a little valley. So really all you can see, see this white smoke? That's all you can see. As you go further down the road, you're inside of that smoke and you can't see anything additional. So. There's no better view that way. We tried. I'm gonna see if he'll give us just a quick uh, update and then we'll get out of here. Six units. Is there more? Is there more units than 26? That, that are here? Yeah. No, no, I mean, unit, apartment total? units. Apartment units? Yeah, total. Uh, I thought 26 seemed like a low number, but that's about right. What up, man? What's up, brother? How you doing? Good, how are you? Good, good. Do you want to get in on this okay. one or you want your own? No, I'll get on this one. Okay. Well, yeah. we'll do both in one just to save you some time. What's that? We'll do two in one. Oh, okay. That works. I'll give you my uh, umbrella Need here, too. name and all that shit? Uh, yes, please. Yes, please. Okay. Tell Come me on. when to start. One second. Uh, 
right, I'm ready. Yeah, go for it. Oh, okay. All right, if you could give us your name and then sure. spell it, please. Brave Little, C R A I G L I T T L E, Public Information Officer, Los Angeles County Fire Department. And what brings us out here this evening? At about 6 42 this evening, LA County Fire Units were dispatched to a structure fire. Upon arrival, they We can go again. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Go again. absolutely. At about 642. Well, uh, uh, let's do it all over. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. First name? You mean, uh, yep. So, uh, you'll, so you'll start out with your first name. Okay. And then uh, spell it, please. Okay. And first, then uh, just give us a rundown. Okay. First name, Craig, C-R-A-I-G. Last name, Little, L-I-T-T-L-E. Public Information Officer, Los Angeles County Fire Department. And what brings us out here this evening? So at about 6.42 this evening, Los Angeles County Fire Department units were dispatched to a structure fire. Upon arrival, there was a apartment complex that they came upon with heavy fire, excuse me. Upon arrival, they came across a, upon arrival, units encountered heavy smoke and fire out of a, an apartment unit. Sorry. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Upon, upon arrival, Units encountered heavy smoke and fire out of an apartment complex. Upon seeing this, uh, I had everything right beforehand. Um, sorry. Yeah. Let me, let me check one thing here. Sorry. So upon, upon arrival, uh, units encountered heavy smoke and fire coming from a large apartment complex. It was then that it was decided to escalate this to a second alarm fire. Um, we are still involved with active flames that we are fighting right now. There are no reported injuries to firefighters or civilians, and we will continue in progress right now. At one point, there was, uh, it, excuse me, at one point this fire went from a second alarm to a third alarm. We have a approximately 100 plus firefighters on this fire right now. And is there any information on where to send the residents? Uh, any post or staging area for them? Um, where residents are staged is currently unknown. Um, we don't know how many residents were actually in their apartments due to this holiday. Um, we'll have more information right now. We'll have more information later. So can you tell me how many units are affected? Well, the entire complex is approximately 26 units. As far as the affected units, we're not sure at this point. Do you still have any units standing? Pardon me? Are there any units still standing? Um, uh, you mean... Uh, complexes. Com complexes. I think they're all standing. It's, it's all standing. just a question of the, the contents and, and the roof and everything that's involved with that. We don't know the number of occupants that were either there this weekend or on vacation, so we'll have more information for you with that as well. How long do you guys expect to be out here tonight? It's really difficult to say how long we'll be out here. First, we need to get rid of the active flame. Then we have our cause investigators who will be uh, finding out exactly how this happened. And do you have any tips on what if somebody finds a fire? What should they do? What's the first thing they should do? If they find a like fire. Like if they find a fire the in their apartment, yeah. Uh, depending on the size of the fire, try and, um, if it's a kitchen fire, try and cover your food or whatever happens to be burning on the stove. Um, if it gets to be out of hand, um, definitely call 911. Um, it's always good to have a home fire extinguisher ready for the smaller fires. Thank you so much. No, no units, or excuse me, no residents uh, have been hurt. Any firefighters, home firefighters? No reports. Boring now. So I'm gonna try to get my camera out of the rain right now. This is too much.
All right, he's in Loma Lita. Or Lomita. <laughs> I might have added an extra Lita in there. Cats and dogs coming down right now. This branch right here couldn't, han couldn't handle it. I'm soaked. My backpack is dripping right now. I do have on good boots, thanks to Kim K. Shout out to Kim K. Woo! Sounds like a helicopter. I don't think there would be a helicopter up now, would there? Okay. Alright, it's gonna be sideways for a minute. <laughs> Whoa, bro. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to shield my camera as much as I can. You can see it dripping down into the circuits. I'm gonna use this cover right here. Okay, cool. Oh, let me see how bad it is. Uh, there's an apartment fire over there. Apartment complex is on fire. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. I still hear uh, them sending more resources over here. All right, get ready to run. Sounds like a helicopter. Uh, If I would have known how wet that we were going to get, I probably wouldn't have gone. But what can you do? Soaked right now. There is a helicopter. I'm surprised. Oh my god, this stuff's so wet. Look at the camera. No bueno. Woo! Who's still in here? Bopper, Holly, time to change, Jonathan. Thank you guys for sticking around. Woo! That was an official sheesh right there. Sheesh or sheesh. Sheesh. Coming from King, repeat the mileage. They're coming in muffled and low volume. Alright, hurricane okay, mileage is 11973. I'm swapping up to and, uh, some drier gear. Ocean and Avalon, Cotuit 3660, and Rd 516. Run misdemeanor, Western and 20th, code 2, and 3581, RD 2081. Oh, that, that sound we heard was the chat box. Yeah, yeah. Pulling a gray beanie. 
the light jacket. On for additional, it's code 210 rd Here's the, here's the helicopter right here. Surprised that they're flying. Woo! Let's write down the button. I heard approximately 15 shots and heard people running towards the park. Nothing seen. Code 3 incident 3738, 3326, southwest of Hanlon. Then you, uh, camera calls, OCC, and someone in the west of the Eight touches, three, seven, four, two, or G7, Now, give me a, uh, do you understand? Can you see if there's anybody out there who has a, uh, check that can respond to you on some of the mental? Three level. Code 6 on 1, 7th and Metro, identify. Uh, please, you're from 30 tons of Maldo, to 2 tons of Maldo, you've already stopped. Okay, here's what's going on. When I got up there, there was a lot of smoke. The good part was that the smoke wasn't coming toward me. Oh, thank you, Blue Sky 1972. Get yourself some hot coffee, tea, or hot chocolate. Thank you. So uh, when I got up there, I think it was Channel 7 and Channel 5, I'm guessing. But uh, there were two people that were filming through this little gap. I, I was thinking, you know, they, were, they parked across the street. They're going to know if there was a better view than this. So I got that gap shot. When I tried to move around, they weren't letting anybody move around, which is understandable. Uh, if I would have gone down that hill, that uh, guy that I zoomed in on, he would have freaked out. He was watching me the whole time to see how rogue I was gonna get. I know that that was not a good shot through that little crease. That was the only shot other than what the helicopter is doing right now. So I know some people were probably tuning in being like, are you gonna upgrade this angle? There was not an opportunity to upgrade that angle. We took what we were given in that instance right there. All right, it's pouring. I'm gonna take us into LA. We're gonna chase some calls. And I'm gonna watch the, the calls all the way through Orange County. So if something else comes out that's good in Orange County, we'll go to that as well. Uh, but right now we're heading back into LA. Welcome everybody, if you're new, thank you for checking us out. I covered breaking news in Orange County and in LA. Right now we're in Orange County, but we're heading to LA. And here's what the scene looks like here right now. They've got this road blocked off. This is Rolling Vista Drive. And then all the units are all down the street here. And it appeared that the residents were staging at the building that was just north of the apartment complex. Uh, but when I asked the PIO, he said that that was not official staging, so I don't know. I also saw a lot of the residents at Jack in the Box under their awning. But look at the rain. My The back of my pants soaked. Saturday night though, what are you going to do? Highway Company Unit, San Francisco Return Vehicle, Plat and Highlander, Plat and Highlander, Code 3, Incident 3754, D2132, Valley Traffic Unit 100 on the Overturn vehicle right now on Plat, that's the one we just heard. Southeast Unit, Parcel Gate, Evan Progress, 1922 East 103rd Street, 1922 East 103rd Street, Suspect Deployed from Melbourne. Sorry about the stuff that I missed when I was out there. Thank you to JLS Media, Joe's Lawn and Snow, thank you for the gifted. Appreciate that. Go so throw him a sub, JLS Media. Thank you, Joe. Wow. No more drought. Freight dog, thank you. Freight dog, thank you for the sticker. I know when I'm watching the replay, I'll see some people that I missed. Really sorry if I missed any of the stuff that was going on when I was out there. Thank you to Ellie. I'm sure Ellie like thanked people for me.
One King 182, One King 182, command. Sure. Donald Fielding, what that? How long have you been streaming? Uh, about five or six years? It's raining all day in Vegas, too. Nice. What up, Bonnie? 6940 Platt Avenue, Coach US at 3766, RG2133. Parking the rear lot on the south side of the business. Who's the small thing, Hooper? 1822, East Front, there's three locations of business. LEE 10 gifted, thank you, LE. Thank Monica 50, get a poncho. Yo, thank you, Monica. It's something warm to drink, great job, thank you, Monica. We're over by the refinery. I have about 50 ponchos in here to give to people that need them. And the ponchos that I have to give away, those came from the viewers. And the other supplies that I have in here to give away, those came from the viewers. I have some food, uh, some tuna kits that came in from Old Fart Andy, who's done that so many times. And then also we got a bunch of socks. So I have a bunch of dry socks, a bunch of food, and all of our regular supplies, as well as 50 bunches. 667-68-67. Thank you, Monica. That's really sweet. Thank you for doing that. Six Jetta and Gallo on the 8461 temporary plate. And thank you, Ellie. Congrats to the new members that just got a membership from Ellie. I think I'm going to be out of the chat for the majority of this stream tonight. So thank you in advance for uh, behaving, taking care of one another. I'm just going to be the tour guide. I'll try to look over when I can, but it's going to be few and far between tonight, I think. Far away for you, please. This is Figueroa Place. You can cancel 234 on the call on the uh, hangar. Towards this morning. 26 T34, 26 T34. Catch your response to 3753, 26 T52. All handle. Up here, 31 watch 3. Anyone wants to listen to you, I'll get it off my head. Okay, this is 110 North. Roger, I'll log you off. You can try to log on. Pack off again. This lane, this rain gets loud. 4737 Rain Street, subject located. Rain Street. Here, it says Paul. Funny to like South Main Street, that's business. Oh, Main Street. That is a Rain Street. 3 George, 20 feet over. Whoa. Whoa, I don't like that. I do not like that. Oh, I don't like that. First race is here. There, 192, one up there, Jim. Thanks, we're very close to tonight. I can find three. Last night. I dropped everybody off at the airport. I turned off the stream. I started driving home and I hit a puddle that was so strong that it felt like I drove into the sand at full speed. Like it slowed me down 10 miles an hour hitting this puddle. Like it felt like I was wrecking the car hitting this puddle. We're in a beige hat, black jacket, brown pants, black shoes, carrying two bags, one of the bags of a Marshall's bag. The code 3 is at 3781 or 854. I've got the rear wiper working overtime as well. Rear is the road, please. 
Last night I was talking about uh, the kid from Goonies and instead of Sean Austin I said Brian Austin Green. <laughs> that was my fault. I meant Sean Austin. <laughs> when I was doing the chapters last night I heard it and I did my little cringe face. I was like, oh. Unit, Labrador Street is at 3650 Every time I hear Labrador, I think of Cheech and Chong. Correction, I'll be on the pick for nine leaves. Item area. What kind of weed is this? It's Labrador. I've never heard of that. Labrador. Yeah, my dog ate my stash. I had to follow him around for a week. Vehicle 3787 Avenue. Correction, 3787-3656. 1767 and RT747. 7787 United 11 Island 33 31 Avenue 33 31 Avenue 33 31 Avenue 33 Yeah, I'm very glad. Thank you for the green car mark on top of it. Here's my roger. 11X, 26, 11X, 26, are you clear? Uh, code 3 is lights and sirens, so as fast as you can get there. Lights and sirens. Urgency. Okay, thank you very much. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye-bye. 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 What's funny is that was the code, one of my first jobs is at Kmart, that was code three. If you needed a manager, code three, <laughs> they used that same There's code. There's a first floor window on the bottom right. Okay, for Roger, trying to figure it out. Wow, I like the lights in the back of this truck. I've never Roger. seen anything like that. It's like an angry eyebrow. To meet at Howard Station for it's a 3683. Roger, 3678. Just 
slot me. What up? Hope you're doing good. Need a bottle of water. Just, just slot me. Thank you for hanging out with us. Alright, there are some good calls coming out now. Fortune 845, Fortune 845, Fortune 811 has a 7 minute meeting. Fortune 845, Adam 46, you can cancel my response. Then you didn't show me the route to Adam 45 as well. Fortune 846, Roger. Day 130 North West Moreland, Sierra Herd 3, Gun Shots of the Elevator Herd, Cook Hill, Smith 3811, and RD 2019. 11 one standby. Uh, you missed the accident on PCH and 110. I just looked it up. It's not close. We see how long it would take to get there. Yeah, you're right. I think we could probably go see it. Let's go try. There's two that are relatively close. Can you tell me repeat? The whole broadcast. Roger. 97, 8, um, Nora, Edward, 240, no one, no one, 2010, Honda. We'll go check on the rollover on PCH. Chestnut in Southgate. Thank you to the people that are always giving me the updates in the chat. I don't always see them, but when I look over and see the update, I really appreciate it. 1926 I'm using this app called LAIT911. I know a lot of people that watch me use that app too and kind of follow along and they're like, hey, this just popped up. I think that's cool. Roger. Alright, this is how long before we're at that rollover on PCH. 7.8 miles. Suspect number one, male Hispanic, late 30s, heavy set, dark hair, no further description, suspect number two, female Hispanic, late 30s, heavy set, dark hair, and dark eyes. Mother comments for additional, it's code 273817, RD 23. We have a bunch of these ponchos for later. Stack of them. 41. Here we go. 823 and then 841 route. We'll be there in about seven minutes. So can you see if there's an available PR that's going to step out of feet? Oh, yeah. And a rollover crash just came out in Santa Ana. Walking down the tracks, red line subway, heading eastbound. Over. Then I is unit to 9889989, screaming man, 15040 Van Owen Street, 15040 Van Owen Street, in apartment 111, code 3 incident 3822 or D923. I think there are going to be a lot of rollover crashes tonight. The tow truck driver is going to have a busy one. Hello from Michigan, what up? Shout out to Terry Sparks. I don't know if Terry's in here, but shout out to Terry. 
Zero zero five twenty eight three at the five seven party. Roger on three clean four. Fair enough, Fifty. No, I'm not returning for this. Wow, it is boring. Two and Jarvis. Mary Queen. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, 24 Queen 15, we're on a county wide task force, so try not to show the LAPD RD. 24 Queen 15, Archer. 31 FP 201, the R02 has been notified. There's somebody behind me with blue, blue headlights. Six and white sedan, possible wolf going with the tip window. Our home for additional switching on 38, 31, or he's on 65. Like they're not even blue white, they're just blue. Seven fifteen to twenty for double. Roger. Nineteen battery domestic violence, seven three two zero Hazel Dean Avenue, apartment three fifteen, code two and three three eight three six or D nine zero. Alright, we're about three or four minutes away from where the call came out. Watching from Hawaii. What up? What up, Brit? Shout out to all the Hawaiians in the chat. Six, six, three, seven, three, forty-two, forty-one. Code six, seven, three, eight, three, three, six, Yeah, blue lights is illegal. Pretty sure yellow is illegal too. Monica, thank you for joining my members. And thank you for that huge super sticker earlier too. Thank you for that. Welcome to the membership. Go see all the stuff that just unlocked for you in the members only area. Now I'm taking the door, making verbal threats. Flip this to 339 or D939. Just left, 9th in Los Angeles. It's code 2 and 10, 377, 91 to 74. Sherry, buy a couple of tickets and a towel. Thank you, Sherry. That's cool. Thank you very much, Sherry. I saw Shannon Hansen told me that the uh, that the lotto was big. Are you hearing the scanner over the rain or is the rain too loud? Open unit, 459 hot call, 3801 Flower Drive. Welcome to all the new homies. Thank you, Jeremy, mutual support. Get on Stringers Live, nice. Joe's Lawn and Snow, send me an email. StringersLiveLA at gmail.com. Thank you, Joe. Roger. 3875, can you send incident 3764 to my stack? And can you verify if the bus is still stationary at the location? 3875, Roger, have up. 3330, call 3330, Quinn. Whoa. Grab 590, you guys have a last one. I've got a request. 345 of the PR calling box, uh, owner of the residence advising the suspects are to the rear of the location. Three male Hispanic tidy. Dan L., thank you so much, Dan. Gifted five memberships. Thank you, Dan L. Thank you, Joe. Dan and Joe, thank you both. All right. It says that this crash is coming up here soon. I'm looking. Here, turn off. Citizen flag down. Turn over. Night park station. 
can have a RA response for a male, possibly 45 years of age, uh, suffering from lacerations in his face due to an assault. We have a rampart unit also response to be a, for a 2 11 investigation. Connect to the camera. I believe suspects possibly disabled the camera. Mission on 3840. Yeah, be here a while. Show me what's good. Quarter, apartment complex. The barbecue area near the pool. Roger that. Okay, so I didn't see anything up on top of the highway. I'm coming underneath here just to make sure that it's not underneath. I'm going to get right back on. Here, let me check one more thing. The size clean Lincoln 5 and the watch. Because 6. 3848. Hmm. Roger, Roger, Mitchell. Southern Please come in. Yeah, I don't see it yet. Roger. Here, one, can I get my last board? 3751. 5, 5, Queen Lincoln 5, code 1. Queen Lincoln 5, you have a message. I'm playing with Cam 5, are you clear for Myler? Roger. I'm playing with Cam 5, clear. Uh, I see a cop up here on the left in the... Oh yeah, I do see it. I do see it, okay. It's right here. It's in the fast lane. Two black jacket, gray t-shirt, black pants. Mission incident 3840. Oh no, this dude's walking out there. The unit, there is no unit number. The 3801 is the apartment number. So that looked like maybe an accurate TL that had wrecked in the fast lane, maybe HOV lane. Uh, but not too... It, it looked like a minor crash. Which is good for them and good for us because I was not going to get out. I would have just parked sideways and that wouldn't have been good. Southeast 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 or not back. Actually, we got pretty close at the beginning of this street. We're going into downtown LA. Hi, we have a little 507 party on Parthenia in your stack, incident 3141. Okay, show me around. Crash on Florence right now? The PR's father is in the back bedroom. He's a male, 68 years old. He's bed bound. Additional incident 3840. Seven A ninety five incident three four nine four. Is this what I got on before? I think this might be what I got on that first time. The crash happened right next to us, maybe when we were driving. Yeah. Yeah, this feels like where I loaded on the very first time when we were leaving the fire. And look, you can see the crash is just here on the left hand side. I feel sorry for that officer and the tow truck guy standing in the middle of the highway in the rain. Shout out to all the first responders working tonight. Tough night. Tow truck drivers too. So the PIO is saying that that is a, a three alarm fire and that there were approximately 150 firefighters on scene. 1445, the PR is not en route. 
did. You could contact him by his call back if you need it further. Roger that. Yeah, I'll make you shot. This is 3 d 5337 Heights, 3 and 3 5 30 has movement and within 30 to 1 flower. Fail 30, be advised, the victim appears father is a paraplegic. He is bed bound. Alright, there is a scene that I think I'm going to take us by. Oh, it stinks over here. That refinery smells terrible. 7876, have you done that transport? Be present. How was your quest to step out? It is 1015, about 52 degrees. Cell traffic unit says that. 1272, 1273, ambulance traffic, Broadway Forest, Broadway Forest, code 3, 3, 5, 8, 32, 56. Transit's requesting for 211 investigation. Send me a 3831. Oh, this person has their trunk open. Send me something, Roger. Bad night to have your trunk open. Please send out a message to not take stolen for 8 pounds. Nora Edward 240, vehicle can be bumped all the way in front. Specific, they handle before going outside, identify. Identify. 1486, Roger. Hi, Edson. Hi, Edson, take us around 8 Tom, Nora Edward 640, 8 Tom, Nora Edward 640, vehicle bumped all the way in front. Drive, additional is in 356. I think they probably got hit. I see that their tail lights out on that side. I bet it bent the trunk and they can't close it. But it's probably just funneling all into the trunk. 19L30 watch two. Can you show me clear down to watch? SL30 watch for connect. Central, south of second. And I code six central, south of second. B eight hundred RD four. Donald Fielding, thank you for gifting a membership in here. Thank you, Donald. Happy Saturday. We're on the one ten north right now, heading into downtown LA. Broadway Forest, Broadway and Forest. Code 3, incident 3853, Central Trust County, identify. 3 Road, call Victor 0025. Call 42, please, and Avalon. Traffic, what would you call 3, call identify. 42nd place in Avalon. 1601. Not as much hydroplaning as last night. And it's a little bit. Entry, it's raining hard. This is like straight up blizzard, California blizzard. Wow. Okay. Happy almost Easter to everybody. Nine boys, zebra Victor, four one five. Four five three. You know. On premises should not be there under the comments. It's for Jewish Century 881 or 541. I can definitely feel some pulling on the road. Yeah, 
1950 Morgan Avenue, Suffolk, Classy, North Morgan, Parts 55, Suffolk, Mount Stanley, Black Hooded, Sweatshirt, Blue Shorts, September, Window 2, Via Parts of Location, Information on the Internet, 3 v 3 Traffic in the center, 1785, Highland Trail, Broadway, and Florence, Broadway, and Florence, I'll be Jack of Robinson. Code 3 incident, 3858, or 1393. Robert Williams. Ship crash at Robert Javier Williams. 1158 and a half, East 54th Street. Code 3 incident, 382, 1313 Cable Street, unit time dot welfare check 23171 Boulevard. Code 2 incident, 384 to 785. Will journey handle before going outside identify. Hey, what's your report for G-Man? 5925 West Vigo Boulevard. See the PR on the white. Tesla, model Y, 9 Henry King Charles, 431. Uh, Henry King Charles, 431. We'll direct to the suspect, male. White, 40 years, black shirt, black jeans, inside the vehicle. Monitor for additional code 2388 RD, 750. Pedestrian just got hit. Third fire for firm, then cancel, 13893. Three, the beer is standing by in front of the location inside a silver Buick with their hazards on. Incident 3882, 13 A75 is responding code 3 from Gage and Florence to 1158. They have East 54th Street. Suicide 9531 81st Street. Hunter comments for additional code 2833 Shout out to the chat. Thank you guys so much for taking care of one another in there. We'll be at this call in about eight minutes. I have a new call that I'm taking us to. 13 George 28 Cam, one of the three are responding to the Avalon of 42, please. Roger. And if you could also reach out to uh, find the RO of 401 South. 13 George 28 is requesting an additional unit, Avalon of 42, Cam. 1 and 2 verify 401 South Main Street, recovered. Roger, 401 South Main Street. You can find the RO for me, thank you. Roger, sir. Any other further? 2833, stand by. Alpha additional unit only identify. So, 13 George 28, 13 FB7 is responding. Yo, Susie, thank you very much. Unit, stand by for your call. Three Happy calls. Easter, Susie. Thank you for being a member. 723 now. And thank you, Susie, for sending in supplies for us to hand out. What? Come on over. Hey, I'm thinking of for 10 down, cold dirty ring, 4996 level 7 and 3661 already 20 before it goes outside. Multiple park vehicles. Look at the rocket box on top of this uh, Honda right here. Twenty-eight. Oh, it stopped raining. Eighty Windward Avenue, eight zero Windward Avenue at Ground Blanco. Looks like it's a male Hispanic wearing a black baseball cap, all black clothing. He's armed with two guns in the back of his waistband. He's pushing people out of the location. I know of security. It's code three incident three nine zero two or eight fourteen thirty one. Civic town to identify. He's got two guns in his waistband. Three eight eight five. Hey, 
Avenue, suspect, female Hispanic, 47 years, black shirt, gray pants, brandishing knife at PR, no longer armed at this time. Go to incident 3905 RD 2005. F-33, code 6, North Hollywood, platform station. 845 is responding to incident 3840. We're about five minutes out from this next call. Negative, ma'am. We're, we're going to be in shortly. I've got all my attention on the road right now. That is the call, sir. It's a 3858. Mark Walker, thank you so much. Another. Two rowers we have signed on that were coaches on a TC at Dodger Stadium. They're at NBC now. Are they still working? Delay to the call. 4646, Benny is still near on your landlord tenant is Beta 135 West Avenue 226. Here's any outside of the location. 7345. 46 Ryder. Hey, all the unit animal clothes, T3522 Copeland, please. Code 2 inside 3901, Highway 429. It was so loud earlier when it was pouring. Sound like little mini hammers on the windshield. Thirteen eight seventy five, code six one one five eight and a half, East Fifty Fourth Street. Oh, it's, it's a burglary in progress. I don't think I need to. I don't think I need to be first on the scene to that. Mission to Hill units, check for open mic. Open mic, open mic. Nineteen eighty five, nineteen eighty five, do you have a message? It's going to be for a 2008 Chevy Silverado, license plate of 8 Nora 93247. Advise them that it is going to be overturned, KMA. Adam King, Nora 789. The, they're going to be driving from 9133 Sepulveda to 652 North Tiger Street. If you could also notify San Fernando VD, we're waiting on the FPU to release the one. That's 61 Rochester. Check 420 Park Station. Lake and Earl, Canavina and Sunset. Shout out to LEE for helping me out tonight. Huge shout out to Steffi G for all the love last night. Shout out to Steffi. Mail no further. Fire for additional code 2. I'm about to get off at Bellflower Boulevard here. To let you know what part and of town we're in. The number is in the comments of the call. It's in the 3797. Oh, here we go. I'm going to go to the gray, Central, code 2 and 3921, RDT 46. We have a next 19 responding from Northeast Station. He appears to be in the front. He's a male wearing a yellow shirt, black pants. Queen Lincoln 76 watch for still working or in the watch? That's the Valley 7320 Hazel Avenue is now full three. Turn call back to my specific now has her five year child outside naked and still fighting with her husband. Code 3 is 3836 Nardi 909. 6. 76 is in the watch. 26 Nardi Roger. Council shooting just occurred 14115 Park Street. 14115 Park Street. The pair heard three or four gunshots from outside her prayer apartment on the second floor hallway. Code 3 and 7, 3, 9, 2, 3, 8, 9, 8, 5. Dr. Smith, fit in at the back corner. 
9 Adam King North at 89 to recover and release to owner. Owner traveling from 913 through Sepulveda to 652 North Hackard. There's a golden corral right here. Golden Corral, wow. Who's just responding from our current? In Bellflower. I'll be 39, are you clear? Eli for poker, Woody, you're checking in. What up? Uh, there was a call of a crash over here. That's why we came over, but I don't see it right now. This is what's on the stack currently. I'm trying to take us into downtown LA. I just wanted to see if there was an incident over here. There's a good call in Santa Ana. Foothill Boulevard, see the PR at the location. It's code 2103, 9306, Hold on, let me check out something real quick. Near. I'm looking for a Starbucks. LAIT Fire Corp. Have a great night, Jeremy. Stay safe and dry. Yo, thank you so much. Please go check out this app. LAIT 911. Late 911. That's the app that I'm using to find the incidents right now. It's this right here. Shout out to Jonathan. Thank you so much, bro. South Carnado Street, Apartment 202, Suspect in the Hispanic, Black Shirt, Camouflage Pants, 3 to 2004 white Toyota Highlander license 5 Sam King Union 610 5 Sam King Union Ronnie Zero Compton checking in Silver Shout out to Compton Compton and thank you, Drew Southwest Parrish. Southwest. Have a lovely stream. I'm from Australia to Florida via LA in a few months. Time for a music festival. Oh, nice, Drew. That's awesome. Thank you, Drew, and thank you, Ronan Zero. Thank you, Ronan Zero. Thank you, Ronan Zero. Thank you, Ronan Zero. And thank you, Ronan Zero. And LAIT. Donald Fielding, thank you for gifting a membership. Where are you? Where are you? 
Oh, Terry is in here. What up, Terry? Member for 17 months. That's the top. I think I've only been having memberships for 17. Of course, I'm here. Been here for 100 years. Shout out to Terry. Thank you for hanging out with me, Terry. Good to see you. Happy Easter. 17 months for Terry. It's the top end. Terry was also the winner uh, when I did the first ever points competition. Terry won and she still hasn't gotten her prize yet. But I haven't forgotten. Terry's the first big winner on our channel. Shout out to Terry. Look at the sky. To the call, the peers call back. They've called several swatting calls. All right. I am seeing a couple calls. I want to take us into downtown. We haven't even seen downtown yet. The suspect is violent, unarmed, under the influence of some unknown mental illness. Is it 3901? All units put for Catalina and Sensei. The unit's information only possible 399 the motor vehicle. Also on Sherman Way. Vehicles in Black Ford or Volkswagen Jet Atlassian on Sherman Way towards Manetka. Fruity lands almost. Thank you to Lara R for the PayPal. Thank you so much, Lara. There's another one in here that I missed too. Give me a second. Moving into 445 Metro Warrior. Hi, Eunice. Close to 924 East Anaheim Street. Stay 23. Can you try to raid X58 and have them landline me? They should have my number. 6 x 58 6 x come in. Shout out to GPS. If I didn't have GPS, I'd be using old school MapQuest. Union Redline. Or Thomas Guide. I love GPS. Do you want to take it to the registration, the RO and expiration? 7 Fort Charles X-Ray Boy, 191. That's probably. Six and X fifty eight, six and X fifty eight, come in. Marcella B, thank you for the PayPal. Marcella, that was earlier that I missed that. I'm sorry about that. And Kelly J. Kelly J, Marcella B, Lara R, thank you, all three of you for the PayPal. Rand McNally, yep. There you go, Six and two three, Roger. First of all, the unit shooting just occurred 11417 Miranda Street. It's close to 89 Miranda Street, 1531, no suspect description. 72Z1 for Charles X3 Boy, 191, no one warrant, 19 Infinity 4 door, to Bay, Escander, 7440, pull it up, permit 103, and Van Nuys. Sarah's boyfriend is assaulting her or has assaulted her, no further line is connected. Close to 396, 289, but just. Thank you again, Lara R, Marcella B, and Kelly J for the PayPal love. That's definitely going into my gas tank tomorrow morning from the gym tonight. Roger. Thank you. And thank you, Brian L., for the Cash App. And Linda R. Linda R., Brian L., thank you both for the Cash App. And Michael Galea from Before the Stream even started tonight. Thank you. 
you request a split to the Nintendo 3 run, we'll be responding from uh, Osborne and Lexicon. Central Unit, Criminal Direct Investigation, 107 East Lone Street, Department 91, Monitor Compass for Additional, Code 2 and 39, 69, RD 118. Any unit, family dispute, one side for East Jefferson Boulevard, Burkett SOS location, suspect is a male unknown. Code 2 and 3967, RD 3242. Janet S, thank you for the Venmo. I think that might have been from yesterday. Thank you, Janet S. I mean, that's another question. I mean, let's go for 10424. Oh, I know who this is. Iowa in the house. Thank you so much. Jan loves Iowa. Traffic affiliated say K35 Sports Team Loop at the Casino and TC. Okay, we're heading into downtown. There's a golf and stuff fun center here to my left. I want to take Linda over there and play some mini golf. It's called Golf N Stuff. I love N Stuff. N and 46. Golf is fun too. Hang on the door of apartment 208, and there's just a teenage male with him. The parties are attempting to break the door. Kentucky S, thank you for being a member for four months. Shout out to Kentucky, thank you for that. Mm, let's go north. Golf and stuff, karate kid. No didn't Daniel oh, Russo you, live in Reseda? 13, I don't know. You can leave it here. It's still needed on my call. 1393, stand by. Blue Sky 1972, thank you for gifting. Cynthia got it. 32, what's your location? Welcome, Cynthia, and thank you, Blue Sky 1972. Thank you for doing that. What up from San Clemente? What up? Seven, seven. That's B5 we're in Downey right now. 63 call six in the area, Walmart 50 East Imperial Highway, 1098, 1098, come in. 976 will handle. Set up for unit, unit 210. Lady Mysteries in Newport Beach, nice. 7849 Vantage Avenue, 7849 Vantage Avenue. Victim is a female Hispanic white flannel shirt hiding behind PR's air conditioner by the wood wall. It's code 3 incident 3979 RD 1693. Run the Hold on, sir. What up, L. Hender, Veronica, Data Scott Brown, Mr. Zani, Douglas. Jack and Z, what up? Shout out to Jack and her daughter. Okay, 11 on the Straight to 74 advantage. Unit 441147, Miranda Street, no evidence. Getting short to Roger. Everybody's applying the brakes up here. Target. Suspect described as no white, late 40s, cowboy hat, blue jacket, blue pants, cowboy boots. Uh, currently uh, stuffing uh, property to his uh, backpack. If I could have a unit respond, that'd be great. I got the gear online. I'm going to be a Holy Cross and stuff further. For 205009 en route to CTD. So we We're found right. the traffic. It's thick right here. We're 40 years so. Cowboy had a blue jacket, 
Channel 15, second floor. Commander, are you clear? Mitchell 68, Roger. 17, Mitchell 68, clear. Okay, 19, it's on the police interview, so stay. 15, 152, Victory Boulevard. First thing now, staying 40th of years, wearing a white shirt, blue jeans. Under the influence of cocaine, good to... Uh, we do have a call. We'll be there in about 13 minutes. It's seven miles away. And on L90, can you verify the location? I'll do the driving. You guys just do the viewing and the chatting. Three code six, Florida, Victoria, 8X-ray, William Frank, 142. 15 South Burlington, 415 South Burlington Avenue, first piece of female block, heating up the door, Correct 3 and 3989 or D247, round part of hand identified. 26, 26, Colorado Boulevard. Okay, Colorado Boulevard. 17 is going to be 26, 26, Eagle Rock. 20, 18, the 20, area 20. that I just passed there in Downey, that's where the Marines passed away that were in that SRT Charger, or no, Challenger, they got ripped in half. 1428. That's the new Ionic 5? I think it looks like a, a GTI Volkswagen. Eight eight forty one, Roger. Six eight six Roger. Six eight forty five, six eight forty five. Can you update your status? Smells like skunk over here. Probably did. Or like jungle boys. One nine six one six Boulevard at the Curveball parking lot. Two the Black Blackhawk sounds here. What up, everybody? Happy Saturday. It's ten forty five. Uh, I was taking us into downtown LA, but there's a call that I want to see before we get there. We're about six miles out. Thanks. Great to see everyone. Happy Saturday. And a 507 party in RD 758. Drawing incident 3913 RD 1801. Little Mary, boy, Adam, King, Adam. 194 this city, and a male black bike crown, 61210, UV 1128, 2001 came in. Smells like Cheech and Chong over here. 631, roger, transit clear. Oh, I'm sorry, 61. Today, the one I've been seeing, Platoon, so it's 39 and 700, 171. 61, put on my stack. Okay, Brett. We're on the road less traveled for this next couple miles. Oh, this is a puddle. This is a huge puddle. Whoa! Whoa! Look at this. Damn, I should have just slammed on the brakes and hydroed across it. <laughs> that van in front of us just like surfed on it. Beach Boy Steez. So that's what, on my way home last night, I hit a puddle like that. It's probably doing 30. And it stopped, it slowed my car down to like 20 miles an hour as soon as I hit it. It felt like I just straight up drove into sand or something, like a runaway truck ramp. That's why they're requesting Holovic to respond. New, at the residence, engineer 4001. Confirm notifications and what else? Roger. Has anybody ever seen License to Drive with Corey Haim and Corey Feldman? Uh, that was one of the... Oh, here's another one right here. Oh, shh. 
that was one of the questions when Corey Haim was talk was taking his driving test. Uh, they were like, what do you do if you hit a puddle? Do you pump the brakes? Do you slam on the brakes? Do you go faster? Oh, Kimothy's in here. Shout out to Kimothy. Member for 17 months. That's a long time. Huge shout out to Kimothy. Kimothy's the reason that I have a lot of the supplies that I have, but the fire extinguisher that, that's in the back, that's Kimothy. Bacon maple taffy, Kimothy. Uh, the boots that I have on, Kimothy. Uh, yeah, Cat and Kim have held it down for me for a long time. Huge shout out to Cat and Kim. LAPD. Otherwise, hey. Sheriff probably already uh, dealt with, uh, with those. There. I know every time I'm not wearing my boots that I'm in trouble with Kim. Of this address, which is a house, 3879 Arlington Avenue. All right, we will be there in eight minutes. We're going to the city of Vernon. There was a reported vehicle fire. We'll see if there's a melted vehicle. Queen, a 50 will respond. Shout out to Cat and Kim. Thank you so much. I no match on the DMV. Well, there's a big post office Roger. right here. Post your supervisory small one seven eight five three four to add token call identify. Seven L seventy. Seven L seventy, Roger. Seven eight seventy six, seven eight seventy six, have you arrived? Roger. The female was telling the two males to stop it and screaming. One sounded a bit older, one sounded a bit younger. As far as the males are concerned. Stop it. Stop yeah, stop it. Location. Like he said, stop it. Then I'll send you a renter. No hurry location. 823, it was just cancelled. This is Pennington Way. Canceled. Pennington Way. Redondo Beach, thank you for the sticker. Get her done. Sergio for Fortnite 200. Thank you for joining my members. That's dope. Thank you. Sergio and Redondo Beach. Good to see both of you. Thank you for that. And shout out to all the lurkers. Anybody hanging out with us tonight? High five yourself from me. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, feels like a jet ski. It sounds exactly like a jet ski when you hit the puddle. I we made it. This is City of Vernon. City of gnarly car crashes, basically. Look at these straightaways. It's like industrial part of town with these long straightaways, so. There's some furious and fast driving over here. Brett Place, 1406 Brett Place, for a female, 30 years, violent, combative. Code 3 incident, 3983 RD 541. South Alvarado Street, scene of PR in unit 205. Wall direct to suspect neighbor, not Hispanic, 20 to 30 years, wearing green shirt, blue shorts, third of the with the hammer. Modern calls for additional code 0 simple 018 RD 265. Years old. One was in her 20s. They were both laughing at the female. One was speaking English. The older one was speaking in Spanish. Were they laughing in Spanish or English? Alright, we'll be there in four minutes. That call we just heard is right here, second in Virgil. Six ten thirty five. Repeat the license. Twenty eight. George Frank George three five two. They were speaking Spanish, but they were laughing in English. Oh. Come in. We were over here a few weeks ago uh, for a vehicle abandoned into a house. 
I don't know if anybody remembers that. It was a vehicle into a structure and the driver left and it was here in the city of Vernon. We watched him pull the vehicle out and there was a big Kool-Aid man hole in the house and that's what the thumbnail on that stream is. There's a Kool-Aid man coming out of the opened hole of the house. Full-time lurker, part-time jokester. Shout out to all the lurkers. They're laughing in Spanish, then they farted in Portuguese. Yes. Fifty-five. Fifty-five, please. I was thinking we're going to be clearing off of our traffic stop on correction. TC, we'll handle that call. Come on over, bro. Seven, no further. Look at this ladder this guy has. Okay. Vehicle is a silver Hyundai Sonata license plate 6 Young John Sam 101, 6 Young John Sam 101. Information on incident 4027. This is what I need right here in my kit. Look at that ladder. Shoots and ladders. Hi, all Friday, Roger. Hi, it's Sunday, so free from Harbor Station to 1406 Red Place. All right, we will be there in two minutes. Cheers to everybody hanging out with us. One more hour left before it's officially Easter here in LA. The subject, correction, suspect is a son, male, biracial, 34 years, six foot, 300 pounds, black hooded, zip up sweater, gray t shirt, gray sweatpants, black shoes. Coach, you're at 4028 RD 1777. So judging by the part of town this is, I'm going to guess it's in a, whoa, possibly stolen vehicle. Um, also possibly like a work vehicle, I don't know. But we're over in the part of town that if you scream, nobody's going to hear you. Responding. 5859, you're available for the search. Five minutes. Two eight. Six hundred. This feels like judgment night over here. Area, the male black, all black clothing and armed with pepper spray. It's good to incident. 4032 and already window one. Six supervisor, me 3522, Copeland, please. Found it. Whoo, and now I'm smelling it. This looks like a 18 wheeler that's Oh, it was probably a FedEx truck. And now it's looking like one of those snakes that you light on Halloween. Or 4th of July, I mean. <laughs> oh, and it's raining out here. So they're trying to just put water on this smoldering 18-wheeler. Uh, full smolder right now. I'm going to try to pull in here. They might have a problem with it, but we'll find out. Oh, actually, they're definitely going to have to they're definitely going to have a problem with it because it's private property. Um, so here's an idea. Uh, I'll get right here and I'll see if I can all right let me try this hold on it's not gonna be much better but I'll try Oh, 
Hold on just real quick. All right, hold on. I'll give you guys a shot. It'll, I don't want to stand out here too long because it's raining, but take a quick look. Imagine just finding this thing sitting there like that. Like you pull in tomorrow morning and you're like, oh, did lightning strike this thing or what? Uh, this was a FedEx truck. So see the other FedEx trucks parked here? This is a FedEx truck parking lot, I think. I'm assuming it is. Break out the press pass? It doesn't work on private property. Looks like it got hit with a missile. <laughs> yeah. This is what I have in the trunk right now, thanks to Kim K. Shout out to Kim. I was at a fire in the valley and I put a fire out with this little, well I didn't put it out. I sprayed some on it with my little fire extinguisher and everybody made fun of me so Kim sent me a real fire extinguisher. Oh no way did I leave my window down. What a rookie move. Wow. Come on, Jeremy. That's a day one move right there. Oh, it's cold in here. 
Yeah, this looks like a FedEx 18-wheeler lot. Sincere thank you to everybody chilling with us tonight. Next call. Bird. Or Queen of one of five, man. Okay, Roger that, sir. FB31, sir. So nothing too crazy. Let me see what all the hearts were about when I was out there. Uh, Rain Pakari. Ran Pakari. Thank you for the membership. I see that now. Thank you so much. And uh, Dat Deuce. Dat Deuce. Thank you so much. And thank you, Ran. What up, Kat? What up, LAIT, Cynthia, Sonia, Becky, Ellie, Warlocket, Heather, Barry, Cam? All right, we're going into LA. Here we go. Look at the goosebumps on my hood. The geese bumps. I was going to say I could drive in there, uh, but I don't really want them asking me any questions about that. I took off my safety vest already because it was soaked. First name of Larry. City so, of Byron. Adam Robert Robert Young. 1942 Kansas. Male, white, brown, brown, 5'10, 150. He will be a 2 8 1962. No The B203 RA notified. I'm going to be in Colorado here in the next few weeks. Maybe I'll do some snow driving. If there's some snow, I'll see if either I have a rental car or if somebody will let me borrow their car and we'll go out and do some sketchy driving in the snow. I love driving in the snow. I'll be seeing a racing deer across 135th and Figueroa on the corner. Figueroa. Doing doing that to unknown people. That location blocking the street. Figueroa. 4074 RD 1851. This feels like the area where we saw the vehicle into the building. Oh, it is. Uh, we're going to pass under this big sign that says City of Vernon. It's coming up. Right here. Just beyond that City of Vernon sign. Oh. Yeah, just beyond the City of Vernon sign is where we saw the vehicle half inside of a building. Oh, that was just uh, the musical artist Brandy. I think she was slanging uh, Crown Royal. Wow, good for her. Yeah, it was right there. We passed it. I didn't have time to throw the camera over. Yeah, you're so about me. This been female is 36 years, green trip, green path. Additional has purchased. Don't go to a plan 4045 in RD 2016. Whoa. Pin 
It says gas right here is 569. 569 here on Olympic Boulevard. And somebody looks like they might be pulled over right here. It's so, uh, the road is so glossy right now. This is downtown LA patrol that's on this guy. It's patrol that has a canine unit. Okay. Cool. Can you return back to 595 Let's see, go The suspect has returned and is not in front of the location. Black three, Roger. And I'm not going to do that. 13867 I was going to reverse and give those people some ponchos, but uh, I don't really want to reverse in this. 13881, Shout out to Kim K on the ponchos and the umbrellas. Kim sent in a ton of umbrellas. Roger. We have a couple of those umbrellas with us tonight. I like this piece of art. Let's let these cars go by first. I like this. The artist is called Mice of Millions. Mice of Millions. I think we spelled the street name. It's open, open to it. I think that's cool. Are you clear? Uh, when I opened my window, it was raining on my camera. My camera's sitting shotgun right now. George 26, 13, George 26, code one. Information only work. You're in trouble of art and support. It's heard only. Information from 4061 and RD971. So we're like, uh, Repeat the question, Silverlink. Armstrong. Okay, this one, you're a former teammate with the night. This one's pretty cool, too. Let's be going. And so, like, there's a transient male line in his 40s, black brown, black clothing, black shoes, holding a butter knife, pizza, a 7 Eleven cup. This one is 3888. The game of love, love, love. Love, la 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 Thank you, Ellie on the 10 gifted. Shout out to Ellie. Ooh, we got somebody with an umbrella right here. Looking like Totoro. La 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 la. What is this dangling right here? Any ideas? What is that? I'm hearing some partying coming out of these warehouses. This is the Porty 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 District. I got LA Tacos. Gorilla Tacos. La 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 End of our traffic stop on uh, Crenshaw and 43rd for Queen 15, so 24 Queen. Uh, 
This is cannabis. Yeah. Jack and Z. Uh, Neve asked me to to play some of her pocket money. Oh, yo, thank you so much. Thank you, Neve, and thank you, Jack. Neve asked to pay some of her pocket money to you. She loves your streams. Yo, thank you so much. Uh, Jack in New Zealand and Neve, thank you so much. Is it Nev or is it Neve? If it's Nev, put a number one. If it's Neve, put a number two. Thank you so much. So this is the dark 6th Street Bridge. We made it over to the 6th Street Bridge. Thank you, Jack and Nev. I think it's Neve. I'm going to go with Neve. Thank you, Jack and Neve. This is 6th Street Bridge. Precipitation, 100%. Nev. Did I say one is Neve and two is Nev? I'm going to go with Nev. Shout out to Dev, shout out to Nev. I have to do that to remember it. I have to associate it with something else. Shout out to Nev. Thank you so much for that donation. I appreciate that. And thank you for watching my stream. There's a crash in Hollywood right now. Come on, baby, let's start to play. Come on, baby, let's play the game of love. Love, 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 love. Okay, a call just came out in Hollywood. I'm gonna take us there so that we can see what it looks like in Hollywood Saturday night. There's only 45 minutes left in Saturday night. Then the Easter Bunny is gonna hop, hop through. Coming from the unit that has a garden in the front of location, code 34102 RD 362. Happy almost Easter to everybody. Two southbound units, so we're responding from southbound location. 3434, cancel, and sign up 4102 3863. We'll hand the responding code through Bill Southwest Station to 4525 Santa Rosa Leader. 34 Roger, show the back. 34 I'm looking at the other calls in this area. There's nothing that makes me feel like we need to stay over here. So we're going to go uh, make the trip to Hollywood. I think. Yeah, the, the call that we just heard is where we're going. Highland. I think. What? What? Three nine eight eight. Runway in Florence. Go three seven four one zero eight. Are you twelve fifty six? Well, there's a white Lamborghini, Lamborghini here on the right. On the right, dressed in white. Eighteen point six six in Hollywood. Looking all right. Four seven eleven. Oh, I knew you were gonna come into my lane with no blinker, bro. Look how tiny their back window is. Oh, okay. I don't know who's used to driving in the snow, but when you get a lot of snow that's put on your windshield, you have to just remember in your head what the road looked like in front of you. Because sometimes it's like three seconds where you're just driving and you don't know where you're driving. Like Same thing with slush. Look at the metro rail going across the road. I hate driving when there's a lot of slush and it comes from the opposite lanes. And it's just like somebody empties a trash can full of slush on your car all in one go. It's scary. I've already told the stream before, but one time that happened to me, a semi put all this slush onto my car. It was back when I had the Eagle Talon. 
and both of my windshield wipers flew off like at the same time boom flew off and they did half circle like like etched into my windshield and then we had to put a glove and a sock over the little metal piece and it, that did absolutely nothing and then we had to drive back like Ace Ventura style with my head out of the window all because of slush and then even after I got new wiper blades those half circle rainbows were just always in my view reminding me and my sister was with me and at the time she had this fiance that was from Ireland and we were taking him snowboarding for the first time and he just thought it was such a normal day for me he was just like wow you guys live such a crazy life here and I wanted to tell him like that is not typical bro here's downtown LA LA captains in the house Shout out to LA Captain. I keep trying to heart the. I keep trying to heart the sticker, and it's asking me if I want to ban you. I don't want to ban you. Be careful out there. Great stream tonight. Thank you so much, LA Captain. Please go uh, support LA Captain. He's got a channel on YouTube that has 24/7 scanner action in LA. Please go throw him some support. He's on Instagram and he's on YouTube. LA Captain. Great to see you tonight. Thank you for showing up in here. What up, Kelsey 20? Hey, Jeremy, it's my birthday. Be safe out there. Love your streams. Happy birthday, Kelsey. Nice. Happy birthday. Hope you're relaxing tonight. And Hugh Stevenson is in here, member for five months. Thank you. Thank you, Hugh. There's an episode of Curb Your Enthusiasm when a guy's named Hugh. And they keep saying everything is like you. Like, thank Hugh. Hugh. <laughs> thank you so much, Hugh. I appreciate that. Happy birthday to everybody having a birthday this month. Celebrate the whole month. And California is no longer in a drought. Looking like Pacific Northwest tonight. Thank you again, LA Captain, and thank you, LEE, for the 10 gifted. We're heading into Hollywood. Uh, there is a. Oh, shoot. That just tried to pull us into the rail. There is a crash on Highland in Hollywood that we're going to go check out. I don't like this lane. This is the lane where you get splashed and you hydroplane. I like this middle lane. Jeremy spoke in Jeep today. <laughs> Jeep today. A lot of traffic. I wonder if anybody out tonight has goulashes on. I actually just bought a pair of goulashes off of Timu. 
It's like a, a very flimsy, cheap pair of goulashes that have traction on the bottom. Unit Park Open Door 11533 National Boulevard. We used to put we used to put trash bags around our shoes, but then it's just so slick. You need that traction. You need like a little skateboard grip tape on the bottom of your trash bag. My dad used to wear goulashes over his dress shoes. <laughs> Negative. Am I saying that right? Is goulash the the food? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm second guessing myself. Goulash kind of sounds like a casserole right now. Joseph L, thank you very much for the sticker. Thank you, Joseph. I see that. Everyone is saying goulash is delicious. <laughs> so, so what is that? What's the cover that goes around your shoe? Touch up units, have units. So you can wear them all day to keep your shoes dry and then have a nice little meal at the end of the end of the night. They need more uh, fashion things that turn into meals, I guess. Are you for an RP to meet? So what am I thinking of? <laughs> Can anybody read my mind and try to like tap into what I'm actually thinking of? Maybe I'm thinking of shoe lashes. Is that a thing? If not, somebody check that URL. Shoe lashes. Dot com. Maybe I can get that URL. I can bring goulashes back. Rubber goulashes. Units have tonic 52, tonic 52, ambulance, traffic in the street of Bottle Figaro and 61st, Figaro and 61. So if it's Figaro in 6-1, that might be an essential worker that got hit. That's where the ladies of the night are. So we just heard vehicle versus pedestrian, Figaro in 6-1. That might be a lady of the night. Never thought I could hit by a car. David Snyder, thank you for the membership. 1001, Avenue. Subject has returned to location. 35, the PR has left the location. Has no further. Goulashes in your feet. 96th <laughs> Street, no evidence was shooting. I remember watching, it was somebody that was missing their arms and they were shooting, uh, they were shooting with their feet, like operating a gun with their feet. And they were amazing, amazing. Only traffic hazard in the area of Page of Flower, Charlie out in all directions, incident 4129, ID Okay, GPS told me to keep going, but I'm gonna try to take this back route. On 13, George 28, that's it. Hey, do you need a rain poncho? Yeah. Can I throw it to you? Can I, can I throw it over to you? Oh, nice. Good catch. Stay dry, bro. Damn, I threw that like a playing card, like right into his hands. And I blew, I, I compensated for the little Frisbee golf turn. Roger. Isn't goulash like 
hamburger, macaroni. <laughs> I'm thinking like tomato sauce. Oh. That's why is that's why it was telling me. I think it's like up on Highland. We're behind Capitol Records. Thirty one eighteen thirty one Rock. Peace out tonight. Not to me. Where's your card? Nine eighteen Roger Venice, Roger Reamers, not coming up on field file. Robert, Adam, Young, Mary, Edward, Robert. Three one eighteen fifty thirty one eighteen fifty. You clear? Thirty-seven is requesting a Southwest Patrol unit to respond to Seventh and Jefferson to the ambulance traffic for a possible domestic violence incident. On incident four zero nine three. This Southwest is where we were yesterday. Oh, Lucy, I'm home. Oh, Lucy, you're so crazy. Look at the drool. Drulio Iglesias right there. We're rolling with a ton of a ton of stuff in here. A lot of ponchos. Hey Robert, wasn't baby? I'm gonna have to maybe tonight when I stop the stream I'll take a couple of these ponchos and I'll show you what it looks like when I throw them I bet I can put all three of them on target at least two of them are gonna go where I want them to go where are you going, bro? Whoa. 31 that Pacific Street, Country from Crash on Expo 21001 Expo. This is 5429 Hollywood Boulevard at the Ralph's Market. Whoa. So, 274 143 already 689. That might have been at Rock and Roll Ralph's. Oh, no, they said Hollywood. Rock and Roll's on. She's arguing with the suspect inside the apartment, the entry code. It's pound 1957. She's in apartment. Scurvy Tooth, shout out to goulashes. <laughs> I, I need to make a merch shirt that's like, I'm having goulashes for dinner, and it's just a dude eating like the plastic covers that go around shoes. <laughs> I will have merch in the month of April. I've never had merch before. I will have merch in the month of April. That's not an April Fool's joke. I will have things that you can buy to support the stream in April. What up, Philip? What up, R.A. Clark? Joanne, what up? Ellie? LB? All right, we're close to this. I'm looking for it. This is also a pretty old call. I don't know if it's still going on. Three one, respond to Jefferson and Sixth Avenue. I knew somebody that used to live right in these. My my friend that came into the chat last night, Dark Tooth, uh, he used to have a hip hop shop over in the valley. It was called Basement Records. And then my friend that I brought on the stream a couple of times, Laron, he lived in the apartment next to me. And then my friend Aaron lived across from us. This is about 20 years ago, but I've been through a couple different earthquakes here in LA. 
and usually they're just kind of like the shake ones where it just kind of feels like a vibration and it's not too intense it's not scary there was an earthquake that we had when I lived over in those apartments uh, near those dudes and it was terrifying okay here's the here's the crash right here I'm gonna try to get stopped at the light um, it looks like there's a truck it's a car versus a truck this is what brought us over here Actually, there's two. There's two crashes. There's one here, and then there might be one a couple blocks away. Trasner Z, what up? Sorry, I haven't been in in a while. Have not forgotten about you. I promise. Trasner Z, great to see you. I haven't forgotten about you either. Thanks for chilling. Screaming woman. Thirty-eight seventy-nine Arlington. Thirty-eight seventy-nine Arlington. What I was going to say is we had an earthquake over there once and I've never been scared in an earthquake until this earthquake that I'm talking about right now. It went on for about 17 seconds. Maybe I'm exaggerating. I don't know. But it felt like 20 seconds, but it felt like when you're standing on a boat, like it felt like the earth was moving in several different directions and it actually freaked me out. None of the shaky earthquakes have ever freaked me out in any way. It's actually pretty cool. It's like, oh, whoa, vibration, it's an earthquake. This earthquake, I couldn't wrap my head around, why does it feel like I'm standing on a boat in the water? Like, why would the crust of the earth, why would the plates be moving as much as I'm feeling right now? And it actually freaked me out. I, it, it wasn't fun. That's the only one I, I've been in that wasn't fun. The other ones were kind of cool. Okay, that was just a two vehicle crash. Red car versus the truck. These people are all going to have to wait a couple minutes to see what we just saw. earlier. And just advise the south traffic that we're responding with a delay. 25P37, 381 will respond with a delay, and 373, 381 is responding to your call at 3879 Arlington. He already responded to that location earlier. This guy's trying to get one arm wet. Pretty cool. He's going to show up to the club, and one arm is going to look like he just stood in the shower. Uh, uh, on the Hollywood platform, the battery. No further for PR one. He gives somebody a hug and just hits them with that wet noodle arm. They're like, oh. Uh, and we only have one unit left on the platform here, which is thirty one. Cell ninety receive. Whoa! This dude just ran a red. Oh, what's this guy doing? What the hell? Hollywood unit um, to that end. All of that was illegal. I believe I'm out of units right now. And then we have somebody crossing in the middle of the road right here. Perfect. 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 I want to take everybody up here someday. This is a platform that you can see the Hollywood sign. Great view of the Hollywood sign. I went bowling in here once for like 70 bucks for a couple games. And that's why I say once, I went there once. I was like, do I get a free bowling ball? Like a golden bowling ball with that? $70? Everything is just so expensive now. Roger, can you run a it? It honestly doesn't feel like anybody has extra money. The prices went up without anybody getting more money. Linda and I just did our taxes. We broke even last year. We didn't lose money, we didn't make money. We just broke even. Here's Roosevelt Hotel. Haunted.
I went in there once on a haunted Hollywood tour and they told us about the big mirror that's supposedly haunted. At 11523 National Boulevard, earlier today, it was uh, it ended up being exchange of info only. It's coach who entered in 4172 RD1779. Bye. Well, for further, he's turning 63. What up, everybody? Still in Hollywood. Shannon Hansen's in here. What up, Shannon? What up, Scurvy Tooth? Uh, shout out to Shannon Hansen. Shannon Hansen took me to a, a baseball game earlier this week. And I had a lot of fun. Thank you, Shannon. Huge shout out to Shannon and Mama Hill. What up, Taylor? What up, Seneca? Fernando? Shout out to Linda for giving me this Yeti for my birthday. Mm. Mm. We're in Hollywood. We're on La Brea and Hollywood Boulevard. And I feel good tonight. We turned Good Friday into Great Friday last night. Now it's Great Saturday. Some racers. Does anybody remember the Nintendo game called Rad Racer? That was one of the first NES games that my parents ever got from me. Rad Racer. Hands with DUI traffic. PR, additional PR call back if I suspect vehicles, possibly the orange Toyota Corolla Ashback driver, male Hispanic, curly hair, bloody nose, white t shirt, and shorts, visibly 390. Still code 3, incident 4165, already 1101. That call looks like a good call, but that's far from us. That's a half hour away. Building is run by Gaiman's Lock. I can't go for that. No. So stand by. Can you... 623, we're unable to locate now. PR is suspect. Can you do a callback? Oh, Wendell's is busy yeah, tonight. Further. 25. 325, are you still code 6 on 3rd Street? Yeah, 325, we are. Thank you, okay. an investigation. <laughs> we don't need to go to that. Alright, viewer discretion is advised. There's a call for an assault victim over here. We're going to go see what's up. Three fifty seven three five five in route. Two incident four one six three ninety one sixty six. Whoa. Unit ten forty three forty three battery in progress one four one three Crusado Lane one four one three Crusado Lane. This used to be a, a high end car place. I think it was called Platinum. Look how they bombed it. It says paint public property. Wow. They got bombed like Vietnam. We're heading to Hollywood Boulevard. We can be there. Well, we were just there, but we can be at this scene in seven minutes. Eight, correction, four, one, eight, three, four, eight, fifty-nine, nine, handle, four, eight, fifty-nine, your starting location. All of Unit 459 is responding code 3 from Holland X Station to 1413 Cassandra Lane. Elevator rescue just came out in Marina Del Rey. 
Officer 729 North Marine Avenue in apartment 2. What a night to be stuck in an elevator. Uh, let's take Hollywood Boulevard all the way down to this call because I don't think, I think by the time we get there, it's not going to be anything to look at. So we might as well have something to look at on the way there. I can't believe they don't have this Ross sign lit up. Is that no longer? No, it's still Ross. Last night we saw somebody get pulled over just a little bit further up in front of Hollywood High School. And he had on a safety vest that looked like the one that I was just wearing at that last fire. And the cops ended up letting him go. They told him that he fit a description. And they pulled him out of his car, had him all in the hood. We had 4,000 people looking at him live. From the warehouse. And then they're like, no, it's not you. Have a good night. They were unable to reach any RPs at the time, but we'll call back if any response. Both Rogers, we came to their phone around. What are you doing? I can tell you, let's go to the sleep room. I can't believe how many people are just kind of casually strolling around like it's not pouring rain. 357, come in. 0457. 357, a phone call to the PR. The PR, someone's using her phone number to place calls. She advised she received a call yesterday and she did not request PD. They do want westbound traffic for the train, stopped, or the bus. So to confirm the call was placed yesterday or, or was it placed today? I was placed today, however, the PR's phone number is being used by someone else. Someone else is using her phone number for a callback. What? The possible will be out. Roger, we're still going to clear the thing regardless. Do you still want westbound train traffic stop? Yeah, stop it. From a possible driver with us. Right, we're on Hollywood we're Boulevard going east. We just passed Hollywood and Highland. Just going shortly. 497 clear, Roger on the dispo. Thank you to everybody chilling with us. It's still 11.45. We still have 15 more minutes left Saturday night. We're in the wood right now. Up to no good. Three sixty-three open five eight. Five zero one four six Avenue. Team on the premises without the proper code. Code two incident four two zero seven RD three ninety two. George thirty six is requesting backup rearing in supervisor central and sixteen for four fifteen man with a gun. Code three incident four two zero four eight total. Man with a gun. So the code three possible shooting just occurred. Car gun. From Central. We do call from the vehicle. Uh, rollover crash in Orange Roger. County in Irvine. Culver and Deerfield. Oh, what is this girl doing? Well, you guys couldn't see it, but she just pulled over in the middle of Hollywood. She's outside of her truck, just hanging out. 99 In the middle of the road. Record three starting location. Very service station. Three to five here's twenty from seventy service station two six zero three west forty nine street. Seven three next next call handling. Thank you having five projects in good call. Yeah. Switch a West for attack 2 tunnel 4 0 for the VCC. Domestic violence suspect 3743 and a half, Montclair Street. I'm hearing siren. Oh, an ambulance just passed behind us. 2 Thank you to Donna K for the PayPal. 
Thank you, Donna. Appreciate that. Thank you. Don't bring everybody to the fun. Well, you need code 4 Central and 16 Suspect in custody. Okay, I'm going to leave. Who is this? It looks like uh, Siegfried and Roy. Okay, this call that we're going toward now, this uh, came out as an assault victim. But it was quite a while ago. 7 Roger. Come go ahead. Roger, do you see your PR on Liggett? Amoeba Records. Roger, we'll meet them now. MGK Roger. performing live for some reason. One at 63 watch three. That Already happened. happened. Okay, next, L3, Roger. What up, everybody? We're on Gower and Hollywood Boulevard. We're going toward the call that was an assault victim, but it was quite a while ago, so I'm thinking that we're not going to see too much, so enjoy the cruise while, we're, while we take the time to get there. We're probably three minutes away, a mile or so. Have any person tonight? $20 to park on my left. The I just saw some generators sticking out of those uh, homeless structures. Yeah, I still see uh, an ambulance up here, I think. Dark over here. A lot of street lights are out. Tony one, trust code six. Can you read me the comments of call? Well, this Hollywood hotel right here says no vacancy at the Downtowner Motel. Wow. I thought that was a pay by the 15 minute hotel. No vacancy for the next half hour. If everyone at you want to do that us. Shout out to Mama Hill and Shannon Hansen for taking me to that baseball game. Any down to unit V26237 to block Westbound Nordoff traffic at Louise. Lois. All right, this is where we're going right now. Assault victim. So it was, that was just the area that we passed over right there. I think it might have been down in the subway. That was the entrance to get down into the subway. 
fired her only 1382 Edge Cliff Drive down the street from the location towards Winslow. Not to for additional pursuance in 4222 NRD 204. This is Thai Town. Oh, there's a Riven just parked right here, a Riven truck parked in the road with all the lights off. Okay, from Eagle Rock Avenue 31 to 1965, Rodney Tron. Whoa, the line in front of Jumbo's is long. Twenty six T Roger. I like Thai food as well. Oh, we're in the area where the lady said it's not a barbecue, you idiot. It's actually right here. 245, 2845, come in. Well, it's close to here. 2845, right there. He's like, geez, lady, quit tripping. It's just a barbecue. It's not a barbecue, you idiot. She's like, look at the whole neighborhood, it's smoky. 4205. Roger. North Roscoe on 7 Union Control 959. That's going to be one of the shirts that I have for sale in April. It's not a barbecue, you idiot shirt. Or apron, I don't know yet. Uh, Linda and I used to live in this area. My wife is Cambodian. So we used to crack up at this uh, sign right here. There's an oriental market that sells oriental groceries. Not the most PC, but uh, you know what they mean. All right, I'm gonna pull into uh, Jumbo's and let you guys see what the line looks like at Jumbo's. Look at all these people that can't wait to get their jumbos on. This whole line right here. I wish I was standing in that line, to be honest. It's a very good time. No mediums allowed, jumbos only. Oh, look at her outfit right here. We got strawberry shortcake right here. Oh, it smells like marijuana over here. Marijuana, marijuana. Do you wanna? Give me love when I put the flame on ya. Hey, no, it's easy. It's all very early. 4419 at Half Price Street. Between Hillburst and Commonwealth, multiple routes heard. Now they're close to location. No further. Code 2 is in 42, 42, 30, 11, 42. Right, this area is called Little Kardashian, aka Little Armenia. I'm gonna take you over by House of Pies on Vermont. We'll see what's happening at HOP, the hop. Let's go do 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 the hop. This is Barnsdale Park here on the right. This park on the right has a very nice view of Griffith Observatory and the Hollywood sign. And this car right here with the turn signal has their lights off. I'm gonna try to tell them. Hey! 
Yo! Hey! I thought your lights were off. Oh, they were for a second. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, you. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, this is Vermont. And this is the best effing hot chicken right here. Best effing hot chicken is what that's called. Thirty-six RP one hundred one. Thirty-six RP one hundred one. Come in. Alright, this is a little hipster area over here. It's between Little Armenia and Silver Lake. Linda and I used to come over here and eat in all these little restaurants, but House of Pies is up here on the left. This is one of my least favorite uh, post offices ever, right here on the left. I can breathe, send another printer. Oh, here's Guac Daddy. Los Feliz Movie Theater. With Guac Daddy. Okay, this is it right here. House of Pies. It's a family establishment. I'll let you look inside. Let me know in the chat if you need me to go in and actually look at the pies. Because I will. I'm not scared to go look at the pie. It's not jumbos, but uh, it'll do. All right, let's go look at the pie. Let's go look at pie. Uh, let's go look at pie. Hi. I just wanted to look at the pie real quick. Which is the best one? Uh, the one that the most is the banana. Banana cream. Do you guys have custard? That's the worst idea. Custard? Yeah. Oh. Thank you very much. The one that sells the most is the banana cream pie. Uh, I actually have a little cup of banana cream pie in my fridge right now. Or I did. Maybe Linda ate it for dinner tonight. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was kind of Franklin and Vermont. That's right. That is the Casa of Pies. Como se dice pie? Okay, let's see. Let's go look at pie. Let's go look at pie. 
Mama Hill, happy birthday, Shannon Hansen. Wow. Let's all take a moment to let that sink in. Happy birthday, Shannon Hansen. I, I don't know if my planet Earth would be the same without Shannon Hansen in it. Huge uh, shout out to Shannon Hansen's mom. You did a good thing bringing that one into the world. Thank you. Thank you, Shannon Hansen's mom. Mama Hansen, thank you. Uh, Mama Hill, thank you. All the mamas, thank you. And a uh, huge shout out to Shannon. I don't know what I would do without Shannon. That's a fact. For, for Happy Joe. birthday. A lot of birthdays this month. I hope Shannon's partying. Oh, we have an elevator rescue that just popped. Fat burgers right here on the right. Happy birthday to everybody celebrating this month. Uh, can I get one of the units in the Upland and Pacific to come down to Pacific and Front Street? We've got the other uh, vehicle that was involved. It looks like it. I get the ride. Three units. I've seen that Pacific and Upland response to Pacific and Front Street for another vehicle involved in the Okay, I think we might head down head downtown. There are a couple good calls downtown. Thank you again, Mama Hill. And also thank you, Mama Hill, for inviting me to uh, Angels game. I had so much fun. 946 South Bonnie Bray Street at the business code 2 and 10 at 5, RD 275. 4208 and RD 314. Here are the calls in this area. I think that makes one of the way to keep my call from my side. Show me out the station, please. Crash on 13, five Roger. and 110. 13 George, 35, 25 minutes on tow to terrain. 3142. They're now Richmond and Mission Road at the dead end. Left on the street, suspect like vehicle number one. I know it's called two doors, suspect like vehicle number two, no further description. Suspect like 13 male Hispanic, 40 years, attempting to gain a treat to business at the dead end. Go to incident 10, 10, RD 441. Okay, we're on Vermont Fountain. Oh, there's a, an assault victim back here on, on Vine. Ambulance battery 1600 Vine. I just saw that. Thank you so much. Thank you for the update. We're going to be at that uh, call in nine minutes. And I'm going to the next location. Thank you, LA Captain, for that. 932 Maltman Avenue. Pure heard six gunshots. Good to incident one five one two zero four. LA Captain, hit me up. I want you to run dispatch for me. We'll work something out. Oh, Shannon Hansen. Thank you, everyone. My birthday wish to everyone is to hit the like button tonight. Wow. Thank you so much, Shannon. High five to your mama. For raising such a cool lady. 21, no further. Shout out to Mama Hill. Maltman. Very LA. These two cars are creeping. I kind of 
kind of feel like getting around them, but then they would just be behind us at the light. They might be looking for parking. Sounded like a machine gun, no further. Oh. 02, incident 21, RD 1153. Sounded like a machine gun. And we just saw Machine Gun Kelly was going to be at Amoeba Music. But that was in February. We're going. Machine gun. When they say something like it sounded like a machine gun, I wish they would follow it by like who thought that. Was it a 90 year old lady that thought it was a sounded like a machine gun? Was it a veteran? Was it somebody that plays video games that actually might know? Linda and I just started playing the new updated version of Contra on uh, PS5. It's pretty fun. Three nine seven eight eight zero four. It's going to be for a black BMW. Oh, look at this puddle. Four four two zero one. Gray uniforms. This is PS off at the PR and all of the bad bombs. Cost for additional for 226 and already 1147. Any for Mr. Blade, so 0106 hours. Okay, 1163. Not a license plate within the tank pop bumper. All right, viewer discretion advised. Somebody thought this sounded like a machine gun. I'm skeptical, but open minded. Oh, this dude needs a poncho. Hey, would you like a poncho? Can I toss it to you? Oh. Okay, I've got some other stuff for you, too. Here's some food and some dry socks. Yeah, what's your name? Nick, Nick I'm Jeremy. Have a good night, bro. Tuna kits came from Old Fart Andy. I need to look and see who sent the socks. Somebody sent me a message and said, hey, I uh, sent some socks to the P.O. Box. I need to look up and see who it was. Old Fart on A. Kira, William X-Ray, 983. Thank you so much to everybody that sent in supplies. And then a Stargator from the chat sent in feminine hygiene products. And I have those with us as well. I have a male kit and a female kit. Can I have a message? Twenty six T eighty Roger. One boy, one four, one boy, one four. What are you uh, doing? Please bring a flatbed. It's a possible white minivan on a license plate with a missing front bumper. Traditional one says zero zero one three. Northbound, Victor Torrena towards Disconso in a white sedan, unknown license plate, observed lighting, fireworks from the moon roof. It's information on incident 36. A racer right here. 33, RD5, okay. Vroom, It 
sounded like a machine gun. No cap. Okay. 1885, no response. 185, in the lobby of 425 East 5th Street. 486, stand by. It's a little cold out here. The 56 degrees, feeling like 55 degrees. Any scooters tonight? Not a lot of scooters tonight. 43, no further. Uh, I'm not surprised that there are not a lot of scooters. All right, right now we're on Hollywood and Vine. When I take a left here, we're gonna see the possible machine gun incident. So this is in front of the hot dog stand where uh, Johnny Knoxville and that little kid was it Bad Grandpa where he was uh, I think that was right here. I might be remembering that wrong. I think it was Johnny Knoxville and the little kid, uh, and the little kid was smoking. And then they were getting people's reactions that were that were walking by. Okay, all that's happening at that scene is that there's a fire truck there. I'm gonna whip it around the block one time and see if there's anything else. Two five. Um, if this is regarding your further for incident four zero seven two on Coronado. You sent out a further to have PR to step out and meet on a 507 party. Whoa, bro. What the f The dude behind me almost hit me because of that, too. Roger, sir, there, I think. 1x23, 1x23, I need to set up some street food and have some goulash out here. I'll, I'll call it on the goulash. Get it? It's that goulash on the goulash. And then it's in like a Dixie cup. Or I'll call it goo on the go. How about that? Goo on the go. Or good in... Good and gone? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, this machine gun call is looking kind of weak. I'm thinking somebody might have just had some black cats or some lady fingers or something. Sorry, traffic in agenda with traffic. Sherman Way and Sepulveda. Sherman Way and Sepulveda. Code 3 incident 47 RD901. It's a valley call. They're now 47 Central, they have a gas station. Suspects are two male, unknown, wearing black jacket, jean pants. Suspects number three is a female, unknown, black jacket, jean pants. Contact you at 51 RD1353. Goulash on a stick. Game is using a belt to have a 242 just occurred, 1714 North Vermont and high top. RD1152. Okay, so here's, here's a serious question. What is the thing called that goes around your shoe that's like rubber? And let's say that you're a businessman, you have dress shoes on. You put this outside rubber shell around your shoe. It zips up right over the, the middle. What's that called? Siri, what's that called? For 44 years, I thought that was a goulash. A sixty-one Actually, I don't even want to know. I'm just gonna keep thinking it's goulash. Sixty-one, Roger. Let me just live in ignorance. Spats? Yeah, it might be spats. That sounds shoe condom. It might be that. Roger, but could you verify? Shoe condom, clown shoe. 
Heidi, what up? Heidi Shear, what up? <laughs> Muckers, that's a cool name. I like that. Muckers. I kind of dig that for a couple different things. It's time for Dodgers baseball. Find beauty every which way. Wonder bread bags. <laughs> Who's more famous, Vin Diesel or Vin Scully? And who do you think's a better bowler? Vin Scully in his prime or Vin Diesel in his prime? I gotta I gotta go Vin Scully. I think that generation was all about playing cards and Billiards and bowling. Um, 10 10 to current court at the LA Live low level parking garage. Suspect big of the white can on a license plate. Those things are all black, wearing a little white Dodger jacket. I think we're going to go downtown. Retrieving a gun out of the vehicle and placing it in his jeans pocket. Number it's me. Incident 55 ready. 1 81. One Here's Roro's chicken. Hey, would you like a poncho, a rain poncho? Can I throw it to you? I'll throw it to you. Oh, I threw it. Yeah, that was a good toss. I almost got it to you. All right, man. Have a good night. That was another perfect toss. That's why I tried to show it. I'm really playing the angle on this poncho toss. I'm two for two right now. Like that went right into the bread basket. It's just like a frisbee. It like it curves this way every time, every time. So I just aim it a little bit to the side, and then it whips right back around. The the first guy, the guy that was over there when we exited, I put it right in the Super Bowl end zone same thing with that guy at the very end remind me i'm gonna take like 10 of them and see if i can put 10 on target i bet there are a couple people that don't believe me i'm gonna put my my money where my mouth is <laughs> at the end of the stream hopefully i don't have any left by the end of the stream but if i do i'm tossing them danger two for roger oh this girl decided to wear her white skirt tonight in the rain Perfect, perfect, perfect. A white skirt, huh? Okay. It's raining out, but you know, whatever. Actually, that's probably. She probably changed to the white when she saw that it was raining. Thank you to Cat's Meow, four months in the gallon of gas. CD, thank you very much. There's a fire truck passing by right here. But it is not the electric fire truck. Six and X forty one, six and eight seventy seven, six and X forty one, six and eight seventy seven response to the station for six and one ninety. Thank you again, Cats Meow. Happy birthday, Shannon. 
And thank you, Shannon and Mama Hill, for taking me out earlier this week. Object flying from vehicle. Was that a poncho? Hopefully it wasn't a poncho. There's a on that vehicle. Callers reporting a poncho flew out of the vehicle, went right into the bread basket area in the end zone. Complete for a touchdown. But you know what I should do? However many, however many ponchos I have left at my apartment, I should make a video unedited and just show you like how many I can put on target out of 10. And then let people guess. People are gonna say four, and it's really gonna be more like nine. Call unit 1283 is responding code three from 77 station to 5700 South Hobart. Hobart. Palladium. Negative. There's no tracker. Victim already left as well. Port 97, PR advised, he still hears the arguing coming from in front of and west of the location. No further. 97, Roger, thank you. Want to comment for addition on incident 69. Does anybody remember, we were right here for that Michael B. Jordan crash. And remember that huge uh, transient thing it was like a homeless structure and it was chrome like it looked like a big I don't know it looked like an old school RV like a chrome well, RV you're back from the bottom, like an Avenue 490. I was on an LA uh, Facebook page and somebody was saying check this thing out it's like a homeless encampment and that person had relocated the whole thing and I still don't understand how like you would have had to have hooked it up to a trailer hitch or something to move it. 3017 ambulance shooting, 5700 South Hoover, 5700 South Hoover. Subject is a female, like complexion, black hooded sweater. I tried to find the picture in here, I, I couldn't find it. This was a possum that I saw last night, right before I got home. There was a possum that was all white on top with black legs. Like tuxedo possum. Let's go to 77 RDA39. All right, this is where we were last night when I saw that crash that was on the on ramp. I doubled back all the way for this crash, and then we sat here for probably 20 minutes to wait for them to clear it. So last night, that guy in the Mustang that wrecked, he must have been coming down just like this and then went into this guardrail here on the left and it pushed him across the road to the other side. Oh, his bumper was still there. Rewind it and you can see his bumper is still there. <laughs> or his front, yeah, his front bumper. His front fender. Wow. Go back and rewind it. You can see the front of his Mustang just chilling there. I wonder how long it'll be there. Probably at least six months. Before somebody takes it and like melts it down for their homeless encampment. Penny Harbor Unit Ambulance Overdose, 302 West 7th Street, outside of Godmother's Bar. All right, we're going from Hollywood into downtown LA. Can I go through Sherman Way and Pennsylvania? Again, holding a clicker to Ringer and RD 991. Can I go through Sherman Way and Pennsylvania? Thank you to Mama Hill for the gifted membership. Mama Hill, baby. Anyone Thank you very much. Thank you very much. 
Sherman Way, west of Dakota. Anytime, Sherman. All right, we're back in Little Bangladesh. That's this part of town. Welcome to the family to speed 3987 Bloodline Avenue. Success Hill, Sonic 23 years. Good chance of Navy 30, 377. Karenissimo got it. Welcome to the members. Plaza. Close to 382 or 393. All right, it is Easter Sunday. It's 1230. Almost 1230. I've been live four hours and 20 minutes. Four twenty. Shout out to Matthew D. Five eight one, Roger. Hello, Matthew Roger. It feels like there's less hydroplaning tonight than last night. 1630 South Union, code 2, incident 50, RD 299, and a trespass suspect 1530 South Hoover, incident 2996, RD 291. Run for to handle identify. 7817, 7832 with a slight delay. Clean 54, 30, clean 54. My grandma, when I was young, my grandma used to make me go to this after school program, uh, religious after school program. I think it was at a Presbyterian church. Uh, they made us sing this song. Uh, I don't remember a lot of the songs, but it was some Easter song and it was going, He's alive! He's alive! He's alive and I'm forgiven. Heaven's gates are open wide. He's alive. That's the only part of it that I can remember. Yeah, for some reason, I always think about that on Easter. I think that was part of like a an Easter. We always did like these vocal recitals that were terrible. That was the low light of my uh, upbringing were those vocal recitals. And then for a while, my mom had my sister in vocal lessons. And since I was too young to like stay home by myself, she put me into vocal lessons. And I've never forgiven her for that. 40 years later, I'm still like, that was a, that was a poor decision. But I do like the piano lessons. She put me in mandatory piano lessons and that was a good thing. So I guess those two things kind of even each other out. All right, there's a crash up here on the right. I can see CHP and maybe a tow truck. He's alive! Jeremy, is a tenor? Is tenor the low one? What hit the time of my life? I want that low. This is CNN. I want that low voice. I'm dreaming of a dry Christmas. Is there a way to lower your voice? I'm gonna have surgery to lower my voice. I'm gonna start a GoFundMe so I can get that James Earl Jones voice. Darth Vader. This is Three. Suspect is because of Melford in 27 years wearing a black shirt. Black Shore 390, I'm called the PR on her brother's close to and 7 91 RD 1693. At the IHOP, I'm right behind Ohio Avenue, Incident 92. We made it. I'm also a huge fan of uh, Cadbury cream eggs. 
I like Cadbury everything, but especially the Cadbury cream egg. Ooh, thank you to Old Far Andy in the chat. Piano lessons from a teacher. Hold on. This is a, see how everybody's fucking up right here? This is a bad little interchange. Oh, and then this dude in front of me is trying to flex his mom's charger. Piano lessons from a teacher with terminal bad breath. PTSD for life. <laughs> Thank you so much, Andy. Thank you for the tuna kits as well. We've been passing those out tonight. It's raining. No further. That's 24 to 25 years wearing black jacket, blue jeans, black shoes, with white bottoms, 390 as well as a PR. Blasting and walking on Flint towards Sanborn, Mark on traditional code 2 and 10 0 0 9 9 or 11 to 16. 17 8 9 9 5 air fight, what's before? Hey, excuse me. Hey, you need a rain poncho? Can you give a couple to those people over there too if I give you a couple? Yeah. Here's some food for you too and some dry socks. Okay, thank you. And here's a couple of rain ponchos. Uh, appreciate you. Stay safe, bro. Right, God bless you. Oh, there are a lot of people making little heat fires underneath the bridge here. You know, Group 1725, Government Street at Government Park, inside near the Basketball Forest Park, for the new location, playing out music, being a disturbance. Cut 10 to 1099. We're back downtown. Alright, reception's gonna get bad through this little piece in here. Please be patient. 21 on a call in February. There's a cold indicating pound 009. Can you send me clear? It's just 62 action. This is where we saw the ending of the police pursuit on last night's stream. It was right here on Figueroa. Hey, I have rain ponchos for you. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Oh, for free. Have a good night. 1741. She said for how much? Just the third one. For a $3 bill. A I'll only accept a $2 bill. <laughs> That's the most LA thing that I've heard tonight. For how much? Your tank or towers? Correction in the area of 340A West Sunset Boulevard, Pierre Hart 3 Loud Boom, and a flash of light. Information on incident 109. 3 Loud Booms. That might have been a rock for the last 8558 Columbus, code 288, RD 1983. I run Figueroa heading south. 14876, come in. What's cold out 
Five eight forty one, Roger. Five eight fifty five, twenty minutes for Joe. Three nine minutes over to five one nine East Eight Tree Department six zero six. Code two incident one zero six thirty one seventy six. One one nine seven one zero. Hear the calls. Fire alarm. No. Traffic collision, maybe. That's pretty far. Traffic collision, 110. So just a couple of sloppy crashes, and that's it. Right here. 4253 Hillcrest Drive at the residence, and then 0110. And cutting it. Investigation 5601 just out Avenue. Cruiser was in Hills, Kenobi G line. Code 2 incident 111, RG 2177. Center traffic units in this traffic, Avalon Jefferson, Avalon and Jefferson, vehicle versus pedestrian. Code 3 incident 113, RG 1333. Center traffic units. Alright, what we just heard right there, vehicle versus pedestrian, I'm going to take us over to that. There were just a bunch of A team looking vans right there that people were living in. So instead of an RV, they're living in like an Echo Liner van. I think when people lose their homes, they look in the paper for like a big van because they know they're going to be staying in their car. When I was homeless, I wasn't homeless living on the street homeless. I was living in the back of my Jeep. And I don't even think that that compares. Like I had a, I had a safe place to be, even though I didn't have a house, I, I was safe. To be able to stay in your vehicle is such a big upgrade. Something's going on over here. Kind of looks like there's a vehicle on the tracks. Oh, I think this might be a vehicle on the tracks. Those are train tracks right there. I think. Yeah, look at the lines. This vehicle is on the tracks. That's not good. 54, 54, have you arrived? Oh yeah, they're on the tracks. They're trying to move it. Are you for real? Are you trying to move it? So, let's come back and look at that. There's a crash right up here too. I can't believe that dude is on the tracks like that. Hopefully they're shutting down the, the train. Runaway train never... Wrong way on the one. Damn, that was a freshie back there on the tracks too. I don't even see that on the stack. Uh, I'm gonna go back to that. Now that I think about it, I, this is probably a better call than the one that we're going to. Avalon and Jefferson, Avalon and Jefferson, code three incident 113, already 1333. Shit, that's where I was just going. Can't afford to cancel out the unit. Call am I going to whip around forward. again? I am. This is just the indecisive night for me right here. Call 45, call 45, cancel incident 113. All right. Thank you, Redondo Beach. 
loving my Passat. Is that what this is? You know. Uh, loving my Passat. Thank you, Redondo. Tune in, run misdemeanor CPI and fall. CPI and fall is a street sign. Fourth and Euclid, go to and say 124 I will be at this uh, Number vehicle versus pedestrian in three minutes. Viewer discretion advised. Stand by. And it definitely smells like weed over here. I am Bill Silver Dose, 519 East 8th Street, at 106. FD handled and was unable to locate. 950 Road Trump. There's quite a bit of glare coming into the phone. Some bright lights. Penny T, thank you for the cash app. Oh, she just left me a cheat sheet about goulashes, too. I'll read that here in a second. Thank you so much, Hello, Penny T. Signing 21, Roger. Nice, Emma. Curry's labor room door, incident 128. Run for Anatoly, four calls in the QRD 299, an additional one is 299. 291 and 205. Tori 73, Tori 73, Cam 771, 278, Tori 73. For galoshes, for the feet, goulash to eat. Oh, so they are similar. Vehicle is able to move Mazda, suspect is a male black, 30 years blonde hair, tattoos on his face. Following the PR, go to intent 13. I've never second guessed myself more than when I started having a chat <laughs> like when you have a chat everything that you say that's wrong people are like uh actually that's highway not interstate you transplant <laughs> i think people that have been here a long time know that you need to research the stuff that i say i'm not right quite a bit of the time Seven eight thirty three, roger 49 do you have a message so next time i order goulash and they're like what what size oh that was a recently wrecked car right there wow that car that was just leaving the scene rewind that and look at their front headlight they had a bashed out front of the car and the headlight was broken i wonder if they're leaving this scene that we're rolling up on right now because all i see is an ambulance i don't see any police and we see that out here. Like sometimes it'll take 15 minutes for a cop to show up. So you can do whatever you need to do within that little window of time. Yeah, I only see fire department. To watch for it, or 10 responded. Oh, and there's still street tacos right here. Toy 53, Toy 53, code 30 ringer, 4580 South Figueroa Street, code 2 and 131 RD 1209. Adam 53, Roger. There's a vacuum cleaner right here on the corner, right by the fire hydrant. It's probably a little wet, but it never stops. Hi, Viewer discretion advised. Sounded like it might be vehicle versus pedestrian. I think the vehicle that we saw leaving, I think that's involved. Because like I said, there are no cops here. And the fire department's not going to make anybody stick around. By the power vested in me.
Okay, now I hear what sounds like the first cop showing up. Right down here. Damn, so that took him a long time to get here. This is on Avalon and Jefferson. So yeah, we don't need to stay. Ooh, somebody hit this right here. Once upon a time. Damn. I think if you rewind it to when we were first showing up, there was a car that had the front end damaged and the front headlight looked like it was super fresh. Oh, here's a fire truck leaving. By the one that was just here. Screaming Tupac back, Tupac back. I did not see pedestrian that looked like they were involved. Maybe an ambulance got them and scooped them and took them, but uh, I doubt it. This is on Jefferson and Avalon. I see a pilot, a, a Honda pilot stopped right here. Oh yeah, maybe somebody's in the back of this ambulance, possibly. Yeah. I'm gonna change my answer to somebody's probably in the back of this ambulance. Crazy. Hope they're all right. I hope that the damage that we saw on that car wasn't from them hitting a person. It did look like significant damage. This is it right here. 14 DL92. Yeah, definitely somebody in the back of the ambulance. 345, I'm going to wrap my call to call. A six nine seven eight six nine no less traffic in a tunnel a hit and run misdemeanor eighteen fifty nine all safe incident one three four or D seven seven four. Okay, let's see. Defense of insurance for Lindra on six Paul Charles Point in. You are there. No parties at scene is now responding to fourth and greed for the suspect. Incident one two four. Fourth and what greed? Correction, Roman towards Sayer. The PR's neighbor was following the suspect on the location of the neighbor. Lots of confirmation of the two incident 147 in RD 1970. 1970. 16X4, your PR left the location. She's unable to meet. Alright, I'm pointed toward downtown. 
have any refinement. It seems like things are starting to quiet down. It's uh, seven minutes till one in the morning. Excuse me, do you need a poncho? Okay. Have a good night. She's good on the poncho. Because it's not raining right now is why you don't need a poncho. It's going to rain in three minutes. Inspector number two is a female with blonde hair. Additional on incident 0130. Building in three, Toyota uh, Corolla, four door gray, license Corolla. of five, young, young, Frank, six, five, five. Huge shout out to everybody that's still in here with me. What up, Bubba, Sean, Scott, Triplet, Armando, Diego? Uh, we're still downtown. We're still looking for calls. Early Sunday morning. Thank you to everybody that chilled with us all night. I appreciate it. I've been live four hours, 47 minutes. Cold plated. Six plus 26 place. Code 3 incident 158 RD583. It's your traffic collision, 515 Maybe we'll go see what's up in Orange County. When it's slow here, it's usually slow in Orange County too, but I'd rather be closer to where I'm going to fall asleep tonight. Hi, you know, I'm seeing responding code 3 from Evan Island on 1236 West 26th place. And are you clear? This train line's r still running right here. Oh, look at this puddle. Wow, look at this puddle. Epic. Wow. We're going to have to do the walk on water right here. Oh. Look at this. Wow. That inside lane could have some debris and we wouldn't even know. Alright, this is where the... Is this where the car was on the tracks? I think it is. Look at this car right here. Look at the car. Look at the car. Oh, he's doing the Mr. Bean turn in the... In that puddle. Could walk on water. Could find some way to prove. Is that the car that wiggled off the tracks? I think it is. They might have freed themselves, or maybe the tow truck freed them. I don't know. Freedom. Northern Kingsley, nine King Mary, Norad, nine zero three. Oh, you're on Columbus. Can you call back to get a phone number? Let's wait, 75, stand by. Two male, black, 25 years, black hooded, sweatshirt, and black pants. Go to incident 165, ready, 563. Now we're back by crypto. This channel helps me relax and chill on Friday and Saturday. Thank you, Chuck. Thank you for riding with us, Chuck. There's a vehicle fire on Denker. I 
2069. These are the screens that I think are too bright. 1630 South Union is now bedroom. Suspect there now. Suspect is his sister's boyfriend, male Hispanic, 30 years. Broke windows with throwing rocks at the location. Still going through incident 50 RD 299. In five years, all the buildings are going to look like this. Every yeah, building is just going to be a big TV. Advertising crypto. New social medias that haven't popped up yet. Ooh, there are some calls coming out now. Highway DNA, 415 man, 1647 North La Brea, in the parking lot of Tacos Smoke Shop, see the PR of Black BMW, will direct to Perfect Vehicle to Black Lexus in the suspect is Mel Hispanic, honor for additional clip 200 and 168 RD 643. We're on LA Live Way. I was just watching Carlito's Way the other day. I forgot John Leguizamo was in there. 12 years, 5 feet, 75 pounds. Wearing a black shirt, black pants. Code 2, incident 172, already 1621. Carlito's Way. 1023, traffic pass, 19, Edward David, 472. Five seventy nine for premium. Oh, you can trend right here on this billboard. Thirty one feet, thirty roger. Judge Street, subject of the friend mail, no further. Possible entity of influence, acting erratic. Acting up. Acting up. Hollywood in 1645, additional on the 14 man, 1647 North Lake. Additional party reporting the hit and run involved. Modern comments, additional on 1168. Whoa. March 10, vehicles off the track. Your level seven party one three three one use the street council by the PR. The valley call. One one nine seven two one. Fifty three. The address is four five eight zero North Figueroa Street. It was in the system of South Figueroa. Roger. Runaways, you've been on investigation, Louv and Haddon, code 2 and 172, RD1621. Oh, there's a flipped over car eastbound 101 right now. Or possible cut and rescue, maybe. Traffic 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 there are a lot of traffic collisions popping up. Enjoy Check out where you can already. ID 1154 Glendale Boulevard. Suspect is a female black 25 to 28 years. Black hooded sweatshirt, gray leggings. Suspect vehicle is a black based on personal license. David Charles 37073. David Charles, 37073. Incident 183 and RD 218. 1789 Car Roger. I am the Tanzanian Irish Sign Code 3 from Colfax and Magnolia to London, Burbank. Microfanta. 6910 today, 101 2 4.5 thousand people still hanging out in here. Thank you for chilling. Hope you have a fun Sunday. I'm gonna sleep till 2 p.m. And then renegotiate after that. 
closure. Oh, there's a crash over there, uh, 110. FB41 Rogers Drive. 110 so northbound. Right there. Northbound. 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 And L90, I need to get their ETA to uh, Pershing Square. FB41, your ETA to Pershing Square. Taco truck still out. Al Pastor still being Copy. served right here. En route to Pershing Square with a five minute ETA. One in the morning. Fire. 9863, no further. Okay, we're going to go to vehicle fire and then we have a backup elevator rescue in case we need to go over there. Vader. Five eight fifteen go six in the area, one two three six west twenty six place. DFT current license plate is six Union Victor Mary eight two. Roger, we found it. Thank you very much. Gotcha. Mama Lipster, what up? What up, Zach stuff? Meta Daniel, Spy vs. Spy, Triplet Richard Three, Joseph, 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 Joseph. Ed Main, what up? Twenty four. Diego, Suho, better location. Mike, Lady, John Doe, Ace Boogie. 1336, incident 0068. Roger, Ace Boogie. 1637, DFT call back. They have no units available to respond to North and Louise. 1637, perfect, we're clearing. Cancel it. 6637, Five nine traffic stop, South Carolina Missions, pull it at eight Lincoln William Young for a date. Oh, this dude's driving on the wrong side of the road, on the left. What are you doing? 1385, code 646, east of Central. When he passed me on the left, I was like, wait, I'm in the fastest lane right here. What's left? I created a further um, on the call that I'm on. The further was supposed to be for the Tilden call that I'm on, 3760, just for your reference. Three. That lamp has seen things for sure. Rogers, maybe with a long delay, we're standing by for a EFT or release mission, uh, recovered vehicle. 5885, Roger. Uh, this part of town is called Chesterfield Square, off of Normandy. Oh, there are a lot of calls coming out now. Before Queen Lake and 16, code 6, Laurel Grand and 14, crushed fourth place. Roger, I'm backing. Stand by. Coop for Veronica Lopez Juarez, 8665 Cypress Avenue in Southgate. What up, Tampa Bay? Oh. It's smoldering. Can you 
Moldar, Scully. Another unit, battery, domestic violence. First in Chicago, code 2, incident 151, RD-464. The person's where it was. Call me. Oh, no, that wasn't in response to a radio call. That was in response to closures. It's like a van on fire. Um, it's gray, not baby blue. Gray. The thing is cooked. This is like Lamert and Slauson, that area. 46th Street. I said, what's up to that dude? And he gave me a look like, fuck off. <laughs> I was like, oh, fucking off is the next thing I was about to do. See ya. Oh, there's just a dude standing in the middle of the road up here. 
Do we have to pay the toll or what? Look at this Today RV. Whoa. This is a GMC. Calling back. She's asking if you are going to re respond to the location. The music is still playing. Please don't stop the please don't stop the music. Roger. A lot of people camping in the neighborhoods. Collision involving pedestrian West Hollywood. So it's definitely quieting down now. I think people are getting some sleep so they can die some eggs when they wake up. Oh, I know where we are. What up, Chip Douglas? What up, Zach Stuff? Keith? High Tech Computers? What up? You know they may be dying them eggs. All right, let's see. Fierce Camaros is in here. When is his party? Uh, Fierce Camaros, it's going to be probably the end of May, beginning of June. I haven't locked down exactly where it's where it's going to be, but that's when it's going to be. Are you going to come? Fierce, are you going to come? Shout out to Terry Sparks for staying up late. What up, Terry? Elevator rescue just came out. Oh, there's a racer coming up on my side. Whoa, bro. Nineteen eighty five, you're PR at eighty seven thirty Tilton Avenue. It's there's still loud music coming from that location. There's a new elevator rescue, I think. Let's see. Elevator rescue valley. Thank you, Kyle H., for the Cash App. Have a safe rest of your evening. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. This is the kind of night, or this is the time of night that anything can happen. This is when the big T bone crashes happen, a lot of hit and run stuff. Uh, there's a fire truck that just turned up here. Register 
squadrons running around the residence. Fifth and Hill, I sent the planet for this. Approximately five vehicles to the Marahonda Corps, just still further. Their vehicles are coming down to the location. It's Coach Incident 229 or D142. Oh, they're going home. Okay. This is where the that well, ambulance lives. Can you respond back to Center Corps? We're on Hoover Street. That might be an airship passing over right there. Washington 5 4. 12 o'clock. Jeremy needs a ride along. Oh, Jeremy needs a ride along dog. I agree. I when I was at the fire earlier, I almost left my tripod. So the only reason that I did not leave my tripod is because I got out to switch into a drier sweatshirt. And when I looked, the lady goes, are you okay? And I said, yeah. And I thought like, why is she asking me if I'm okay? Cause she heard a crash and the crash was my tripod behind my Jeep. So if I hadn't had, if I wouldn't have gotten out to switch into a different sweatshirt, I would have left my tripod at that fire scene. And the people that have been in here for a long time, they know that I do stuff like that a lot. That is one of the things that sucks about all this multitasking. It can't always go right. If you're multitasking a dozen different things, at different times, things are gonna fall through the cracks. I've lost cell phones. Uh, that's probably the biggest thing. I've lost a couple cell phones doing this. And the cell phones that I use are all over $1,000, each one of them. So when I get home at the end of the night with all my equipment, most of my equipment, no new injuries to the vehicle. Oh, and I, I, I slipped and fell yesterday before the stream. I thought I was going to have to pay for that tonight. I thought when I woke up that my knees would be hurting or something. Nothing was really too bad, so I really got away with that yesterday. I thought, I, I thought something was going to happen residually and it didn't. Whoa, it's a pain. Short thing, clear repeat. Tell me go six on the call. Sit hell. Let me see if there's any further information. I'll be closer to you. How much do pagers cost? I bet it's like twenty dollars for a lifetime membership to pager. I used to love having a pager. I also loved the uh, T-Mobile Sidekick. I thought that was such a cool device. One of my favorite phones was that T-Mobile Sidekick back in the day. Thank you again to everybody that left a like on the stream. If you don't think that's a big deal, it actually is a big deal. That helps us get the stream shared out. So if you did leave a like on the stream or if you shared it, thank you very much. It helps. I need the syndicate at 507 party, 5780 West Centinella. Incident 195 party, 1469. 24, Queen 40, no further. Queen I feel bad for that dispatcher that's still having that voice issue. I thought maybe I think it was two weeks ago that I first heard that. I, I was hoping that she'd get over it fast, but this seems like week three of that. She must be bummed. I think I already said this on stream, but I had a buddy who 
his voice is always like that. It's always like cracking and it sounds hoarse. He said that he had something caught in his airway when he was younger, like a peanut or something. And they went in to, to take it out. And it was a friend of the family that was doing the procedure, a doctor, and that he messed up something in his vocal cord area. And because it was one of their friends, they didn't you know, sue or do anything additional. And this kid, every time I talked to him, his voice was cracking. And I felt bad for him because people were always like, are you okay? Is something happening? Like he just always had to explain all that, why that was happening. People are always like, did you go to a concert last night? Were you screaming the last few nights? Six nine seventy seven, sixteen X forty one, eight seventy seven, and X forty one. Out of the watch counter. We're in South LA. Eighteen of batteries in the last two four four, eighteen hundred twelve three. Code two is at two four three. RD two forty. For a Turkish interpreter. DHP advised that he was on the gas station Normandy, possibly just north of Adams. He's in a green Toyota Prius. Well, there's approximately three gas stations. Are you able to check them? We're making contact with the door now. Thank you. Can I get the part? Wants a war check on temporary plate. David Charles, 37, Zebra, 73. Oh no. Nine, David Charles, 37, Zebra, 73. Jack NZ, just a thank you, Jeremy. You're amazing at live streaming and great info. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you for the encouragement. That actually does help me out a lot. Thank you very much. I hope you and your daughter are having a great Sunday. 2121, Make aware of the no code to enter to 3 energy 20 one Your show's proud. Roger. For David Charles 37, Zebra 73, temporary plate, returns, record not on file. This is for sure a scary part of town, so you guys keep an eye out. I'll look right, you look left. Let me know if anything's going on. San Fernando and Roswell, like state five, Henry Toy, Zebra 277. Did I repeat the question, San Fernando? Roswell? Did I have a nice traffic stop? San Fernando, Roswell 5, Henry Boy, Zebra 277. Search next twenty eight four two zero zero. Basic center, Roger. This is the part of town where you just really don't want to slow down and talk to just anybody. Like you slowing down and rolling your window down is already aggression. Thirteen George two forty message. Thirteen George twenty four. Are you clear? Uncle, first suspect female female black. If you find the location, want to cross for additional two to the two four nine and already two ninety one. Six ninety twenty three shows on fall fifteen at one three seven seven four Louver Street, and if uh, you could advise uh, at one forty of our location. Five eighty five. We're gonna be here till further notice. Uh if you check C F five eighty five I am would be able to take one four five and one six five both related from us at the completion of their uh follow up to the hospital. Five eight five nine, five eight five nine, Chris.
you, boy. I mean, 59, can you handle the battery domestic violence about 501? This is just the, this part of town, anything could happen. Like, the cops are scared to be over here alone. George Union, 773. Everything is on the table. The suspects are riding up and down the street, hitting people with a paint gun. The PR does not wish to be. No victims. Information only, 7252. And look how dark it is. Like, look at these street lights. The street lights are all out. Check 134 Victory Boulevard, apartment 21, code 2, incident 254, D93. Contact group 29th Street and Western Avenue, incident 205, RD326. Family dispute 2520, West 48th Street, incident 228, RD392. Part of 740-2920, South Orange Drive. Alright, we're pretty close to this. After this call, we might have a couple things we can check out as well. We might go back to Orange County and chase too. You lived in Minneapolis in the nineties? I lived there in the I lived there in the nineties too. Kind of late nineties. For a little bit. Are you clear? I still go up there quite a bit. Three queens by four, Roger. The battery suspect there now, 1203 North Soda Street, Shell Gas Station. Just a vehicle in a white Ford, suspect is Uber driver, mail, and the description. Control 7258 RD443. My location. Jonathan Earl, what up, bro? What up, Nathan C., Lady Mystery, Keith, Francis, Jack, Richard, Maureen, E. Nobody. E. Nobody, how you feeling? How's the hit? Happy birthday, Shannon. What up, Ocean Soul, JD, Keith? Mr. E. One eight forty one, one eight forty one. Are you clear? Forty one. Show me on the follow up to Central Station. Forty one, Roger. See the TV above the street. Give it five years, it's gonna be everywhere. Everywhere in LA, you're gonna look up and there's just gonna be a big ass TV like this. All right, looks like one, one fire truck's leaving right now. Solo vehicle TC into tree. You can see where it hit the tree right there. Major crash. And if this was the tree, the tree doesn't have any damage. Wow, look at this. 
somebody's in this ambulance right here getting some attention solo vehicle TC into tree and it looks like it went straight into that passenger side I hope nobody was sitting where this passenger side was damn that's a major crash There's debris all over the, the lawn over here. Look at this. There's debris like just scattered everywhere. Ambulance leaving right now with the patient. Did it hit, it hit that tree? Yes. Crazy. It was very good. You heard it? Yes, I was sleeping in the pool. Wow. That truck, we saw everything. We saw them like spinning and pooping. Oh, wow. I see the windshield wipers still trying to move on there. Yeah. Okay. Glad it didn't go into your house. Oh, yeah. We have all their info and the guys are going to follow up in the hospital and This is the tree right here. The tree one. Oh my god, there's so much debris just everywhere. I just saw a purse. I just stepped over a purse. So here's where it hit the tree. And the tree looks fine. I can still see the windshield wiper going on the car. I can hear the uh, beeping. I'm getting rained on. You can see the rain it's pouring out here. Look at all the debris. How you guys doing? Hey, how's it going? Good. I'm just taking a look. No, go ahead. Go ahead. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, driver incapacitated, and then uh, just tow are you not? Yeah, we tow. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Was there no passenger? What's that? Was there no, no passenger? There was two people. Oh shit. Is it okay if I step right there and just get a quick shot? It's right here. You don't get hit, man. Yeah.
Pay attention to where you're going. Yep. There you go. I don't think you'll need it, but if you need my footage, it's on here. I'll we'll take it, man. Yeah, appreciate it. it. I'll appreciate that. Uh, I'll let you know. I'll pull it down. Yeah, no, I just want to have, have a second car out here just in case of the debris. Are right, you anything from us? We'll go ahead over there. Yeah, just get a follow up and then uh, call Brian if you'd like whatever. You the wiper is still trying to move here. My guess is going to be It's going to be a while over there for me well, to check. It's a trauma so. center, so they're going to listen to this too. Just go check and they do critical and stable, right? Yeah, go ahead and just get, get the info that you can and lock it up. Have a safe night. Damn, he said there were two patients transported to trauma center. I. I'm having a hard time believing that that passenger is okay. If you're into praying, throw some prayers over to the passenger. That was a crazy crash. I've seen several of those that you can see the indentation of the tree and it's spooky. Like just that round. I've seen it where it's like a, a pole too, like a street pole. And there's just that clear scooped out part where it hit. Man, that's a bad crash. I was hoping it was just a driver, but damn, that passenger. Gonna take a lot for them to be all right after that. A lot of pieces of their car in the road. Pretty crazy. Shout out to the first responders that have to deal with stuff like that. Shout out to the tow truck drivers that probably had a crazy night. The reason I like to show this stuff is to give props to the first responders. I don't think they get enough credit for all the stuff that they do. But also just to remind people like, when you get in your car to go somewhere, it's not guaranteed that you're just gonna go there. You're not just gonna go to the grocery store and grab some milk. Something crazy could happen to you. You just need to have that mindset like every single time you're going anywhere something could happen before I started doing this job I was like eh, yeah something could happen but it won't now I'm like something could happen and, and then that's it something could happen be ready I have an empty duffel bag in the back of my Jeep at all times just in case I were I, I was to get into some kind of, kind of crash I'll put everything in that duffel bag and then don't have to worry about if it's scattered all over the place or if the tow truck driver is going to help himself to whatever's in there. All right, I think I'm going to start pushing this back toward Orange County. It's about a quarter till 2 a.m. Easter Sunday. Huge thanks to everybody that's chilling with us. Uh, I'm going to start, start pointing us south. And this is what it looks like to go from L.A. into Orange County. Thank you to everybody still chilling. And I'm going to check the calls all the way, so if anything pops up, we'll know. If anything gets our attention, then we'll go check it out. Those were cool cops at that scene, too. I was like, can I stand in the road right here and film it? And they're like, yeah, don't get hit. That's a cool cop. Connect 
for you, Roger. You show me around. Gary? Roger. Pacific Party in the area of 102nd and Main. On 102nd, possibly between. Oh, there might be a structure fire over by USC. Possibly related to your missing. It's a male, white, or Hispanic 12 years black, but a sweatshirt, black, and white stripes, pajama pants. Black and white striped pants. That sounds like Beetlejuice. Referee. The do not feel comfortable asking the subject for his name. The subject did not want the pair contacting the police. Hey, Roger. I uh, felt this model 41. That's probably going to be our subject. Roger. We do have a new call. We'll be there in eight minutes. Eight minutes from the next call. You have time to go make some chamomile tea if you want to. Three five eight eight John Lincoln Tom three five eight. Information is in two ninety six and RD one thirty nine. Kirsten, thank you so much. Shout out to Kirsten, I see that. Thank you for that. Kia Optima license. Nine John Frank David five zero one nine John Frank David five zero one last scene at three thirty twenty four seventeen hundred hours. Look at the street lights. Two nine seven RT nine zero six. The street lamps are just out over here. What's your difficulty, Clyde? The CES family. When people in LA see a street light, they're like, "Ooh, that means there's still copper wiring in there." They get the dollar signs in their eyeballs. John Henry Wheeler, thank you for joining my members. John Henry, thanks for joining. Check out the members only section and see what's available for you. Jack and Neve, thank you for hanging out with me tonight. Sanford and Colton Colton is going to be on town in Manchester. Sanford and Colton Colton is going to be on town in Manchester. SB 421, Roger, street level, Expo Crenshaw K-Line, requesting a circle for a female and a 10-year-old child seeking shelter. 14 miles in. Come over Specific units responding to Blanca Manchester to continue your code 3 response. 27 T30 to responding code 2. It is dark. Anyway, 73 or 14 responding to the traffic. They need to raise some money to get some street lights out here. <laughs> There's some light bulbs. I see the posts. I just don't see any bulbs in them. Where's the moon? I don't know. I could use the moon's help tonight on this road. We're over by the airport. Uh, no, we're not. Are we? Just letting up 507 party, 500 South Lake, incident 260 RD 245, and a 507 party, 309 North Kenmore, incident 290 RD 221. 
Yeah, we Stanford are. Stanford and Colden, Stanford and Colden, code 3 and 302 and our team. 1824, there's no southeast or south traffic units available. Roger, the BCC is calling over to the circle team right now. 41, 2, this way, we're going to call, we're happy with Battery, domestic violence, 344, East 100, Hill Street, code 2, 724, 1844, identify. Code 3 and 302 in RD 1824. Unit 1245 is responding. Code 3 from 77 Station to Stanford and Colden. Unit 705. Unit 705. Unit 705. Unit 705. When I was in high school, my parents made me do driver's ed, and I did it with a couple of my friends. Oh, we're by Randy's Donuts right here. And, uh, you know, they're, they're telling you about all the things that could happen. We were 15. No, no, no. We were 14 taking driver's ed. Because uh, you can get a permit at 14 and 15. Uh, the stuff that they were showing us in driver's ed, I wasn't really too impressed by. I was just like, yeah, yeah, slow down, whatever. When they started showing us pictures of the crazy crashes and I recognized the area, that was one of the only things that really got through to me when I was a kid. Like, wow, this stuff really is real. Like, there are consequences to some of this bigger stuff. Even though some of this is hard to see, I, I don't zoom in on people's faces and I don't really try to like capitalize on the agony that people are feeling. I want to show people that you're lucky. When you go from A to B traveling and you get to B, you're lucky. You are lucky that you got there. Anything can happen between A and B. And I just think a lot of people assume like, oh, stuff happens to other people. It really doesn't though. If, if nothing's happened to you in a long time, pretend that something happened to you and just double down on safety. Don't wait for something terrible to happen for you to be like, oh, okay. I, I realize that I need to do something. Just learn from someone else's mistake. Thank you to... Who is this? Sheila M. Sheila MD. Thanks for the LA ride tonight. Sheila MD Pismo. Thank you. Shout out to Sheila. Cheers for that. All right, we're here. There's a... Wow, we've been to a couple of different crashes right up here. This is Westchester. I see a minivan in the middle. Oh, and I think I see a fire hydrant. I'm pretty sure there's a tree down and a fire hydrant. Yep. Uh, or a sprinkler head. I think that might just be a, a sprinkler head. I definitely made a mistake not grabbing my umbrella. Ella, Ella, hey, hey. Under my umbrella, Ella. Yeah, get the light on there. Oh, the tree. This tree will never be the same, ever. Oh, there's somebody still in there. Oh, there's two people still in there. 
at least. No. I've seen this female officer before. They're helping out a woman that's still in there. Oh, maybe his baby's in there? He has a video of it. I'd kind of like to see that video. Send me that video. You can see the camera shaking. I'm shivering out here. It's cold. I don't think this was a fire hydrant. I don't know though. I'm wondering why that lady's still in the vehicle. Why didn't they try to get her out of the driver's side? She's trapped in there. Oh, I think they're trying to maybe get her out of the driver's side now. Oh yeah, they're gonna try to get her out of the back. Good idea. She's okay. This tree is not okay. I'm gonna go out on a limb, say that tree is not all right. And the limb that I went out on is right here. No time for puns. We're not going to stay here too much longer. Feel it coming in the air. It's cold. Officially, it's cold. I think that's probably the last one for me. I'm going to take us from wherever we are right here back into Orange County. If you can still hear me right now, thank you for hanging out. I know it's been a long night. It's been long for me too. 
Good night, though. I can't believe we we started at the the crazy crash in Norwalk. Then I went all the way back to Lomita, and then started driving into LA. And then we drove back for a dud crash. Yeah, it was a well-rounded night. We got some puns in at the very end, big pun. I'm officially chilling. I'm cold. Let's see where we need to go. Trying to reroute us around this. Rerouter. Left the message center for empty. There was no other information. 2019 White Honda Civic Reference Plate 8 John Lincoln Palm 358. 8 John Lincoln Palm 358. Information only on incident 341. Look at the clouds. 2829, 2829, cancel your 415 out of the 6th and Central Incident 287, cancel by MTA. I've been looking at a lot of weather maps lately. I like watching Doppler, seeing cloud coverage over huge areas. 11837, AAA notified Eagle Rock Toe responding with the ETA of one hour. Jeez, an hour? Oh. Avenue is suspect there now. 6025 Avenue, suspect left into the rear of the location. Suspect is a male Persian, 511 black beard, blue sweater, gray sweatpants. Code 2 incident, 340 2161. Crashes came out on fig. North Hollywood Union Ambulance Death Investigation 4854 Lower Canyon Boulevard 4854 Lower Canyon Boulevard. The subject was fired of a solar infinity in front of the location code 3 and 343 already 1545. She said death investigation. That's not good. 13867 <laughs> We're going to Trevor Hazelton and Hard Suspect because of dark color MCB on the license plate going down at the intersection. There's no suspect description. Good to send 346 Sunday morning donuts. 40 1256. Notified Mercedes Coop with the hazards on right at the corner. I don't think we got a police pursuit tonight. Too, to too wet. No EPA. Too wet for people to run. Seven, can you repeat the last word? Six, seven, zero, two, three, five. Thank you. 30, 20, 31. Does anybody have any fun plans for later today? LEE still up. Gifting subs in here. 10 memberships from LEE. Thank you so much, LEE. Thank you for making new members in my chat. And thank you for helping me out tonight, too. Shout out to LEE. Incident 268 RD 464. And happy birthday to Shannon. 1685. I didn't want to call you there. Possible code 377528. Nestle code 21 to the 350 RD 1015. Oh, Keith Hanna got one. Yes. Typical around 74. Are you clear? This is where we would turn if we wanted to go to LAX. 
but we don't. We want to go to John Wayne. Valley traffic in, 16X41, 16X41. Hit and run, Mr. Amino, back and say, it's a good incident, 0315, 1685. We covered a lot of ground this weekend. The top of the valley, now we're in super south LA. Well, now we're kind of on the west side, but we were in south LA. For this car that's passing me right now has purple headlights and he's popping down the road like Orville Redenbacher Suspect threatened the victim with a knife. Suspect is currently away from victim. Suspect two incident zero three four. I can hear his spark plug. Just pop, 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 pop. Sounds yeah. like firecrackers. He has purple headlights. Seven or eight. Let's see if you can hear his exhaust. Three one zero seven. You're not readable. Whenever he taps on the brakes, you can hear it pop. Did anybody ever put baseball cards in the spokes of their bike to make it sound like that? We would also run over a can. Like if you run over a can right in the middle on your bike, then it makes a sound like it's a motor. It follows the wheel around and then it kind of gets caught on the top of the bike. We used to do that all the time. We wanted our bikes to sound like a motorcycle. Traffic call in South Beast. Making one is responding code three from South Beast Station. Making it one realize is a code two call for incident two eight one. Incident zero two nine five. Sixty eight seventy seven hundred. I do have one more surprise before the night's over. We're not done. 1689, 1689, London, Watchmander. Roger. You want me to show you on the follow up and road? I put Rain X on my windshield, that's why it's doing that. The Rain X is paying itself off right now. Yeah. Hey, Rain X, Rain X, Rain X, Rain X, Happy Easter to everybody. Hope you get to relax today. Beach Boulevard. T34FC Rescue 98 is en route currently to Providence Holy Cross. Here's in carriage 2623 Boston, the PR is on the line. 
Whenever there is a street light, look at the rain underneath the street light. I don't see any coming up. They need more street lamps out here. Or maybe the same amount of street lamps, but more bulbs. Crenshaw Boulevard right here. I think in the future they'll have glowing roads. Some sort of something that's glowing. It'd be expensive. But Five four Charles Young seven seven four five four Charles Young seven seven four. Incident three six two RD ten forty one. I'm looking at it in the phone. The phone makes it look way better than what my human eyes are seeing right now. Like it looks a little bit foggier for me. The phone's doing a good job at making it look clear. No, on the railroad tracks. This is Vermont. We're passing right now. There's a little bit of hydroplaning. Not terrible, but I can feel it pulling a little bit. Damn, it's really coming down. I wonder how the flood, the flood areas are doing right now. I bet the burn scar areas of where it burned, I think that is going to flood today. It's probably flooding right now. All these areas that have had bad fires in the last couple years, just going to turn into mud and sludge. 13X21, 13X21, are you clear? Roger. I like to be in the middle lane in case I do like a Mario Kart spin out. Maybe I can still save it.
five additional your pump four four nine hot crown at three four five two Larissa the drive here she said front key will be unlocked you need to go up the green staircase i i'm not scared to drive in rain when i was in high school i had this little eagle talon and it had a uh, snowboard racks on the roof and so when we would put we would put four snowboards up on the roof so two upside down and two right side up the wind would go underneath the snowboard and pick it up like a reverse spoiler so i'd be driving and it would feel like somebody just picked the car up and moved it over and that was in slush snow it was a manual so i was working the gears that's when it was scary uh, i had so many different close calls that's what I'm saying. I never thought that I would even get into my 40s. I had so many risky things happen to me when I was in my 20s. When I was in my 20s, I was like, there's no way I'm doubling everything that I already did to get here. I've been in some life-threatening scenarios. I can't even believe that I'm here right now and even talking about it. There are a couple times I thought this was like the last page of my book. Brown jacket and all colored backpack with a white and blue rusted brown bicycle. Go to today in 0377 or 932. please number more. 345 already 1269. Trust that's right. 375 already 1240. Anybody that lives in a cold state knows what I'm talking about. Black ice. You're, you're going this fast and then all of a sudden you put on the brakes and you start going faster because it's black ice and your heart just stops you're like uh whatever happens happens now i'm not controlling this and you're roger thank you The beginning of Screamy Woman, Oakwood and Western, Oakwood My camera's having trouble focusing. Focus. This is what it's gonna look like on my floor. <laughs> this reminds me of Dorf, the Dorf golf guy.
Look at the rain. Just in case you thought I was out here. Oh, <laughs> look at the rain. Everything I have tonight is soaked. My camera, my phone, everything in my pockets, everything soaked. Is it an active station? I don't think so. That's why I was going up and uh, looking in the windows. I don't think it is active station. it's not raining look at this <laughs> this is crazy this is a uh, California's equivalent of a blizzard At least it's not raining though. That would be bad. Oh, and there's a car behind me with their lights off. That's a bad idea. <laughs> This next part is just me trying to make it home safe. There's a lot of hydroplane in that. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Additional 10 to 15 for tow. Wow! I just wasn't controlling the car for about 25 feet there. Oh wow! It's pulling me all over. That was crazy. That's uh, kind of what I was talking about with black ice. Like, I just had no control over the vehicle right there. It was just locked in. So yeah, I'm worried about myself doing that. I'm also worried about somebody else. Like, if the where's the beef lady is driving and she starts hydroplaning like that, I don't know if she's just gonna put her hands over her eyes and let God take the wheel or what. It is Easter Sunday. I think we need some street lights over here. Maybe just like three street lights, just three. Maybe even some bulbs on these uh, signs that are over the road. Yeah? They're like, oh, they're reflective. It's good enough. So that's what happened to me last night. I said goodnight to everybody at the airport. I started driving and then I hit like one of the biggest puddles I've hit in a long time. Now this dude is rolling the dice. Hope it's worth it, bro. And 1273, 1273 in southeast. Everyone's hitting around felony 934 East 95th Street, Colton 364 and already 1824. 
Oh yeah, now it kind of cleared up a little bit. Can I? Sorry, I don't want you to catch the supervisor in the vehicle. Well, this is just easy now. 7 out 27 out 70, cancel incident. 3937, head to the middle handle. Continue to near 507 radio, 153 West 71st Street, incident 256 RD 1393. Do you see how the clouds are hanging low? When I was just back in Denver, one of the cool things about living in Denver, it'll rain like this and then it will evaporate before it hits the ground. So what you're seeing right there in the clouds, that happens in Denver all the time. It'll be a really dark cloud and it'll be raining and then you'll see it evaporate halfway down before it hits the ground. It's really cool. And you'll look out into the distance and you'll just see like, oh, it's raining over there. Well, not really because it's not hitting the ground, but above the ground it's raining. It's really cool to see. I don't know if I've ever seen it do that in California. It's either raining or it's not. Last night, I got back really late. Linda woke up when I got home. It was really windy in Orange County. Becca, what up? Like Chinook winds hit Orange County at like four in the morning. And it was raining sideways. It looked crazy. Incident 401 rd Oh, oh. That water was just so heavy that it sounded like I got caned. Denver 5280, that's right. Shout out to the 5280 crew. 1461 Sherman Way. Good to incident 399-3914. I'm glad that we got to see the drone show yesterday at Dodger Stadium. There's no way they would be doing that drone show when it's raining like this. We got lucky that we saw that. Has anybody ever seen the drones over Angel Stadium? Shannon Hansen, were you watching the stream last night when we saw the drones over Dodger Stadium? We saw him just briefly, but we caught it. Happy birthday, Shannon. Uh, anybody that missed the stream yesterday, go to the the stream from last night and then go into the comments section. I leave the chapters there so you can see like when we spotted a coyote, if we saw a possum, if somebody tried to slap the phone out of my hand, whatever the bigger, uh, whatever the main things happened during the stream, I put it into chapters. So you can literally just go through and kind of hit each timestamp and see the the funnier parts of the stream or the meat, the action. Put two and some four zero eight and two and five. At least the rain slowed down. Definitely, this is easy now. Thank you to Dev for putting the uh, drone show timestamp in the comments too. Shout out to Dev. In the blue, yeah, two eleven investigation occurred at one two nine four five Carl Place, already fifteen twenty three. Send a bit of standing from the police station, the white diesel Altima, two or two male Hispanics, one diesel body force in the handgun. So those two at the four one three at the fifteen fifty three. Okay, Carl, watch that. Unit 
broad. Sorry. If anybody ever sees something cool that happens during the stream and I miss it in the chapters, please put it in the comments and then I can edit that comment and add it. So if there's anything, if you're reading through those and think like, oh, he missed this part, please let me know in the comments so I can add it. Dev is really good Eight at that. Clean King William racing back and forth and doing donuts. Security on site, code 2 and set 417 already 15.05. Narcotic or something, if I with Pierre 17 year old son over Keith. Code 214 190 18 20. He is. He's in a white Nissan Altima. Correction, he's in front. That's a correction. Shout out to Terry Sparks and Three. Sean 35. 11 8 2007. Like what up, Sean and Terry? I'm saying 330 2020. Why? Thank you for the gifted memberships. Five gifted. Thank you, Why? Congrats to everybody that just got a free membership from Why. Thank you for doing that. Shannon Hansen. Does not have a better location. Thank you, homies. 3.5 thousand likes tonight. My birthday wish came true. <laughs> Thank you, Shannon. Thank you for using your wish on me. I appreciate you. Hey, you know, I owe you, too. Suspect is a female white black clothing backpack in a white SUV in the lot closest to Loveland. Let's go to today, 420 ID, 13-11. Happy birthday to Shannon. Have a request addition to Universe Traffic Central. I think Shannon might be 35 this weekend. Happy birthday, Shannon. Thank you for taking me to the Angels game. I had so much fun. It was fun to hang out with Mama Hill, too. Is this a cop right here? Oh, it's a stringer. He's got the uh, press plate. Nice. Yeah, uh, Bobby, what kind of car was it? Black Hollywood McPian's car alpha. Turtle beast. We found a stringer that's still up. I think I know who that is. One of the jack in the box right there. Pink shorts. Officers are facing eastbound. Eastbound responding is just one south south pulls only. Nine ten around felony nine three four east ninety fifth street code two and three. See, that's why I don't think that press plates are a good idea. When I first started doing this, I was like, "Oh, I can't wait to get a press plate." When I show up to a scene. Everybody there is going to know that I belong there because I have this press plate. It's actually the opposite. It like calls you out. So that dude would have just been a regular dude that wouldn't have been on my radar at all. But since he had that plate, it stood out. No, that was a, a Orange County Stringer, I think. PMTV has a gray charger. Go to it at 427 RE1258. What up, Becklington's in here? What up, Ma Dukes, Julius, Terry, Triplett, Debbie Cunningham, what up, or Debbie Cheatham, what up? Tylenol, what up, Ace Boogie? 
Spanish speaker, of course. Carvana right here. Tower 51, 12 right 73. Car, car vending machine. You can get cupcakes and automobiles out of vending machines here in California. What up, Paul Gatt? Shout out to Paul. What up, Ed, Christian? So grimy, Paul. Tom, Tom Tony, Annie. CCJD, what up, Darren? Took the victim's car keys. My traditional code 249 RD 111. The way the stringer spoke to me last and night, yeah. Zero, zero, zero. We all know who that is. Sure. What was that? South East called that one to 77, but a Southeast unit bought it back. Do you want to cancel the Southeast unit? 7821. Additional on the 415 group brochure and plenty of the suspects exited the bus. This is nice having it all to ourselves. It feels like when I was coming out, I was still driving everywhere during the. George Floyd stuff and during all the COVID restrictions I was out all the time if you go back and look at my footage from 2020 I was out every day even when they told people to stay home they said that press was essential worker so I was out almost every single day you can check it out go back and look at my videos from 2020 May 2020 Seventeen. Seventeen D one code six Balboa and Devonshire, the rear of American Tire. It's me forty one, Roger. Less the information. North Hollywood unit. Do I see Hollywood. others do what I do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a website called stringerslive.com. That's the website that I run. That's the website that's only lost money so far. I've never made money. I've only lost money on stringerslive.com. But that's a list of other people that do what I do. Independent journalism and storm chasing. So if you want to check it out, stringerslive.com. We're on that website right now. It features other people that do what I do. And the, I think the easiest term is just independent journalist. So this is the website right here. And then here's our stream. And if you go up and down, you can see the other people that are live. We've got Media One. He's live with 36 people watching. Adam in New York has 48 people watching. We've got 3,040 people, 3,540 people watching. So, yeah, there are definitely other people that do what I do. Adam in New York does a great job, but his his primary focus is selling it to the news, and the majority of the quote fingers stringer guys that are out here their goal is to send it to the news as well uh, but I don't like the way that the news takes advantage of those independent filmers they don't pay them what they're worth uh, the people the filmers that send them in footage have to catch them using the footage in order to bill even though they know who the people are even though they know exactly who the email address was that sent them that footage they won't send them a payment they make you follow up and say hey you used my footage and then they go oh, okay here's the payment and it's not a good payment so yeah I I'm not a fan of the way that the whole stringer slash uh, news stations I, I don't like how that goes I think it needs to be renegotiated I think they need to make it worth what the filmers are actually risking to get that footage and then the worst case scenario is when stringers try to undercut other stringers 
and it's just like a race to the bottom. It's just people kind of stabbing each other in the back. Oh, you think you're better than I am? Well, then I'll undercut you in this way. I just hate that. That's always been the worst part of it to me. And there are people that do that more than others, but a lot of that comes from insecurity. And the dude that was uh, talking shit to me last night, that has to do with immaturity. And he's got high levels of immaturity and insecurity, so that's a pretty bad combo. But I'm definitely not competing with those dudes. It's me versus the previous version of myself. I don't look at any of those people as like somebody that I'm competing against. I'm competing against myself. I'm just trying to get better. Every three months I look back and audit everything I've been doing. I just try to improve, be better than I was before. But yeah, the the harassment is going to continue all through the summer, maybe even longer than that. But yeah, there's some surprises coming up for the harassment as well. Twenty units to four two five two zero Fulton Street. Twenty units to nine hundred rounds. Twenty units called twelve six zero six Amador Street. I believe you're parking there. I'm going to travel. Alley unit, no trouble. You said you can't be Amador Route Route location. We're getting pretty close to the airport. I'm not using the wipers. Uh, everything that's happening right now on my windshield is straight up Rain-X. Rain-X is worth it. Yeah, I'll hit the wiper now, but Rain-X plus wiper is the clutch combo. Crush the BB or nothing? Right. I've, I've tried really hard not to talk about the harassment stuff. Uh, that was the advice of my legal counsel. They were like, until this stuff unfolds, please just don't add any fuel to the fire. And I was like, yep. But there's definitely a to be continued with that stuff. It's not over. Five, five, 20 minutes before I bed, so. 71, 71. 5, 5, 8, 5. Angle 10, 2, 8, 7, 4, 2, Orion, apartment 104. Code 2, 4, 11, RC, 9, 2, This is Orange County. We're just a little bit north of John Wayne Airport. I love John Wayne Airport. I like Bob Hope Airport and John Wayne Airport. And then my favorite is Denver International Airport. That airport is so huge. 24-7, flights going everywhere, international, everywhere. And because they have so many flights, you can always get good deals. Question 11, 14, 11, 14, 15, 9, 5, 7, 1, 1, 1, 7, 3, LAX, Hilton Hotel. Hotel, 10, 4, 3, 8, or 14, 88. Roger. Roger, 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 Roger. It's a quarter to 3 a.m. Sunday morning. Thank you to everybody that stayed up. This was a long one. I've been live six hours, 35 minutes. We're lucky that nothing happened. We're lucky we didn't hydroplane in anything. Here's the moon. Good night, moon. Here's the airport. Hello, airport. And I'm not, I don't know my way around this area very well. 
I was not born here. I've lived here longer than I've lived in any other state. I was born in Iowa. I grew up in Colorado. I've lived in Colorado the majority of my life. So even though I've lived here longer than I've lived anywhere else, I know that I don't, like this place does not belong to me. I'm not a official representative of California. I'm a transplant. I'm somebody that's a, a visitor. And my wife and I intentionally decided not to have kids so that we could travel our whole lives. That's what we've been setting up for the rest of this year, for the rest of next year, for the rest of the next upcoming several years. We just want to travel. Check out Finland, check out Sweden, see what's going on in Greenland. Maybe go to Prague, hit up Asia. Ooh, thank you so much. Thank you for that. Where's that from? Denmark? Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Welcome to John Wayne Airport. Bureau requesting me with the ambulance crew in the alleyway. TA as of 0158 hours. What up, everybody? We still have a lot of gas. I ran out of gas before the car ran out of gas, so that's always a good thing. Thank you to everybody that hung out in the chat tonight. Sometimes I get a little nervous when the roads are like this because I can't be in the chat as much monitoring what's happening. Um, I really appreciate everybody staying so chill. We have a chat that kind of self-regulates itself. If people come in and start talking shit, the chat will kind of dogpile on them. Uh, Suzanne Steenberg, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Thank you both. Thank you for those late... Uh, we got some two late donations. Thank you both. That's awesome. And I hope that everybody takes my advice and makes this the best Easter that you've ever had. <laughs> spoil yourself, spoil your loved ones, appreciate your pets, appreciate how calm things are right now. This time next year might not be this calm. Appreciate what's happening right now. We're not in a pandemic. We're not in uh, the area where the meteor hit and everybody's going crazy. Just appreciate how calm things are right now. They might not stay like that, but they are like that right now. And uh, just appreciate the, the things that are going right in your life. Don't stack up all the things that you wish were different. Audit the things that are going right and be appreciative of that and recognize that it, it might not always stay like that. That list of things that are going right now might not be the same list of things going right in a month. So. Just appreciate when things are not bad. <laughs> That's my advice. Uh, Jeremy, this weekend has been all about packing because moving date is coming up quickly. Nice. I'd like to move too. Uh, my wife and I live in an apartment right now. We don't have really nice stuff. We could throw everything worth value in a storage unit and just go travel. And we might do that. I don't know. Uh, things are going to be crazy for me in the next six months. Things are going to be crazy in the next year. I'll keep everybody posted, but uh, thank you so much for the support. All of the support means a lot to me, whether it's through Cash App, Venmo, PayPal. Ooh, yeah, that's what I need to do. Oh, uh, an elevator rescue just came out. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna take a couple of these ponchos. Do we even have any for me to throw? All right, I only have one poncho left to throw. I'm gonna to try to hit the windshield with it. Let's see what I can do.
One for two is gonna have to be good enough. That first one was bad. I admit that first one was bad. At least the second one was like possibly a touchdown. I don't know. Uh, Bart Lynn, thank you for the, the last minute donation. I appreciate you. Uh, I'll work on I'll work on my wrist technique a little bit. Uh, I know Linda will want to get in on it too. Maybe we'll film a little video. But uh, Jonathan, Dev, Ryder, Natasha, Keith, uh, Tulia, Kath is in here. What up, Kath? Ooh, I didn't know Kath was chilling in here. Shout out to Kath. Happy Easter to you. And Jetta Jade, Shannon, N62 BMW, what up? I haven't seen you in a minute. Good to see you. Jojo, Sean, Rodney, Old Fart Andy, Bill, Eddie, Trulia, Sean, Texas Angel, Kath, Jetta, Natasha, Triplet, LEE, thank you for all the help tonight. I really appreciate you. GZ, Heather, Kenny's Vault, Infertile with a Turtle, that's an awesome name. Zach Stuff, T Dust, Bart, Heather, Emergency Traffic, Bob Miller, everybody, thank you. Thank you for uh, hanging out with me this weekend. It was a good weekend. If you want to do something nice for me, please leave a comment after this stream ends. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, have a great week. If I don't see you next weekend, make sure that you have the best April ever. I'll see you soon. Take care.